You're checking out Opie and Anthony. Here's something for the people that just sat through the commercials. We got a pair of tickets to the virus tour at the PNC Bank Art Center on Saturday, August 25th, featuring pretty much uh, everyone that's in studio and another four or five guys, courtesy of Blades of Glory on DVD, in stores everywhere, Tuesday, August 28th. We'll take a random caller for the tickets if you're in the, like, New York, New Jersey area. I, I think even if you're in Philly, you, you would drive up for this one. Phone number 877-212-ONA if you want these tickets. We'll give them out to a random caller. There you go, Stan. All right, Louis C.K. in studio. Good morning. Yeah, we just kind of invited a bunch of guys in because uh, we thought Anthony wasn't going to make it in today. And we were just going to come in and just screw around, but Anthony... Yeah. yeah uh, I'm a trooper. We talked about Phil Rizzuto's death. Scooter. The Scooter. You know how old he was? I mean, we all remember him calling Yankee games, right? Here in the New York area? Yes. This how is, old was he? Well, well, he was 90 when he died, but this is how long he was, like, calling baseball games. Listen to this. Waiting to see if Maris is going to hit number 61. Here's the windup. Fastball hit deep to right. Looking in. Way back there. Oh, Maris. Did a holy cow for Maris's wow. first home run. That was a good call. That, that he is good, old. That was a good home run call. And then this really fast uh, before we move on. From uh, CW. Rizzuto was an entertainer calling Yankee games, reading birthday greetings, and speaking about anything during the action. Hi, flying. While it's in the air, happy birthday to Daphne Lapazan. <laughs> the young Greek boy back there, George Plattis from Sheepshead Bay. He wants to say hello to the boys at Castle Harbor, where he's, oh, that's going to be up the alley for extra bases. No, oh, why don't I shut up? That <laughs> 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 ah, was pretty funny. <laughs> See, nowadays, all the baseball announcers, they have to be over-the-top professionals. You don't get yeah. that like yeah. uh, personal touch like Rizzuto also, gave you. You don't get that doddering. Yeah, <laughs> but I like the doddering. Shut up. Good. He used I used to, to hate that. He used to give like restaurant reviews, like, oh, I was at this restaurant in Brooklyn, let me tell you. If he'd look at the game, he'd see that maybe the pitcher's, you know, ready to pitch, and he should shut up. Nah, I liked it. I really did. Yeah, you know, it was different. How many times do you need to hear he's you know, pitching from the stretch? Yeah. Plus the, the guy's looking like so. he might steal. Well, by the way, Plus you're, you're just... watching it, too, so you're like, I know what's really going on in this yeah. game. I want to hear Radio's some interesting talk. Different. You yeah. missed the wonderful call. George George Steinbrenner said that, uh, I guess heaven needed a shortstop. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I think heaven would pick a better shortstop. Uh, just kill Alex Rodriguez or something. See? Well, I mean, <laughs> he's not a shortstop. He used to be. Um, I know, but he could play now, short in heaven. In, in, <laughs> in heaven, he'd probably be good. Not in heaven, heaven, he'd definitely... take a rod. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. Come hey, on. Who's uh, playing now if he needs him? Christopher Reeve? <laughs> <laughs> the ball has to be hit, yeah. bounced perfectly into his mouth. And he has to spit it. <laughs> hey, it's heaven. Basement. Anything can happen. Yeah, Christopher yeah. Reeve it doesn't walk in heaven? No, he's a lumpy. He's a lump in a chair. Who just he's got a there. really crappy wheelchair. Yeah. In oh, that would suck. Oh, I'm in heaven and I can't. What? He always he's got a really out. lousy wheelchair with a like a number spray painted on the back, like the ones at the airport. <laughs> <laughs> That's all he's got. All he does is he's a loser there. But w once in a while he'll walk because they're afraid of hitting the chair, so they'll just like pitch around him. But, but they always double him up easily. <laughs> easily. Hey, before we leave this this part of the show, we should get into that Michael Vick uh, lawsuit. This guy is insane. And uh, I don't know. I don't even know why this made the papers, but some guy is suing Michael Vick for sixty three. Billion, trillion, trillion, billion, trillion, billion, trillion, billion. Well, he wrote dollars. it out uh, in relief. Uh, plaintiff seeks sixty-three. It, and then it's followed by a three, six, nine, ten, eleven zeros. <laughs> 11 it's zero. not even. <laughs> it's not even right. Well, because the commas are like sixty-three comma three zeros comma and three says, zeros comma three zeros comma then two zeros then two and then zeros. it so says it's really a trillion hundred <laughs> right. sixty-three and then all those zeros and then it says in print billion dollars back so he wants that but he wants it backed by gold and silver delivered via UPS what is he a bond villain <laughs> yes. United this States Postal has... Service to the front gates of FCI Williamsburg. South Carolina, collected from defendant Michael Vick. It's hard to read this because it's in his own handwriting, mm. this this complaint against Michael Vick. <laughs> Delivered via UPS. And it's someone wants UPS to put gold and silver. Yeah. <laughs> billions upon billions of dollars. Hey, read this, read this first part, the actual complaint there. Uh, this suit 
is a Bivens action, action and civil rights violation by the Constitution, a laws of the United States, and federal tort claims inflicted by that included, but not limited to, injury to wildlife, conspiracy, illegal dogfighting, extortion, racketeering, gambling, copyright infringement, identity theft, fraud, threats to commit violent acts, brutality, and tax fraud. And I always throw that tax fraud in yeah, there if sure. you got a lawsuit. Just in case you can well, get them. pay taxes on the uh, all that that you just yeah. did. And then violated on the first, second, fourth, fifth, sixth, eighth, and fourteenth amendment of the Constitution. Mm -hmm. For relief, plaintiff uh, plaintiff seeks sixty three whatever this wait, wait, total wait. is. The Second Amendment. <laughs> he went first, second, fourth, fifth, sixth, eighth, and fourteenth amendments. Wait, the Fifth Amendment? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that your right to not self incriminate yourself? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and the Second That's Amendment, it. the Second First Amendment is freedom of speech. First Amendment is speech. Second Amendment. Is second Amendment guns. is guns. Yes. Like the right to bear arms. Yeah. Third, Fourth, third what, amendment is the he's right just to paint willy, the scrotum any color you wish. <laughs> it is oddly, it is. He's just willy nilly the throwing is in the amendments. The right to rape, which people are yeah. totally, <laughs> totally neglected. Yeah. You know, well, people are interpreting it different now, thinking That's the right. forefathers weren't into that. That's but they right. were. Of course, they were. By hey. the way, how funny would be if Michael Vick decided to settle out of court for fifty-eight thousand trillion dollars? <laughs> 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 Calling oh. up the UPS. How much does the package weigh? Eight billion tons. <laughs> it's gold. You got to read some of this. Michael Vick is a quarterback for the Atlanta Falcons. On April 20th, Mr. Vick stole two white mixed pit bull dogs from my residence in Holiday, Florida, and used them for dog fighting throughout the Richmond area. Mr. Vick damaged my RFID chips in my dog's collars, so I will not be able to track them. These two dogs were used for fighting on April 23rd, 24th, and 26th. On April 28th, Mr. Vick sold my dogs on eBay, on an eBay auction. <laughs> oh, this is great. And used the proceeds to purchase missiles from the Iran government. <laughs> oh. oh, you had me until then. Yeah, it was sounding like, okay, Dude, this is all the dog. over the papers today, it's by the way. Amazing how you could just. Who wants do to this? read number, uh, number two Can there? I read it? Oh, I like to read All right. Publicly. Yes. <laughs> I was a good reader in church. Um, Michael Vick continued to harass me on May twenty May fourth, two thousand seven, by stealing my identity from my coat. <laughs> from my coat. <laughs> he left his identity in his coat. His my coat. My identity was used to open new store account cards, to. PetSmart and Doggy Warehouse to purchase food from Mr. Vick's illegal dogfighting operation. Wow. Oh How did he have time to rush for that many my, yards last well, night? Well, why is, wasn't he working on these missiles? Now, yeah, this exactly. is what I wanted to know. Where did the copyright violations uh, come in? Yeah. Apparently, uh, here's his number three. Michael Vick violated my copyright laws by using my copyright name on his personal football outfit and <laughs> casual clothing without uh, paying uh, for before use. use. Yeah. This conspiracy started January 10th, 2001 until the day this suit was written. Mr. Vic uses my name to sell t-shirts, uh, Jonathan Lee Rich's mugs, uh, Mr. Rich's hats. All right. Where did this come from? Like, where does he think? Uh, it, it's coming from, you know, a, a, a spaceship. That's what this is coming from. Can I from. just read what's at the very bottom of the whole thing? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Due to restrictions on typewriters, this suit was handwritten. <laughs> <laughs> restrictions on typewriters. Yeah, the restrictions are there's no longer any typewriters out there. <laughs> My mommy won't let me use the typewriter. Typewriters. Is he a uh, convict? Uh, go with four. I don't speed. know. He's a convict. Four, is, four is the big get here. Four is great. On February 10th, 2007, Michael Vick pleaded plead allegiance to Al-Qaeda. Uh -huh. I'll pled his allegiance to Al-Qaeda, excuse me. Uh, Michael Vick subjected me to microwave testing. <laughs> <laughs> the old microwave yeah, testing. Yeah, this guy was wearing a tinfoil hat for sure. Michael Vick uh, used drugs in school zones. <laughs> that's a biggie. That, that's uh, very illegal. <laughs> and Michael Vick is in the business of illegal steroids. <laughs> oh, everyone's pile on. All these hot on. topics. I'm not what sure would be that better? he's the uh, victim of that. But... What would be better if this was all true? <laughs> all true. <laughs> Every word of it. <laughs> Every if bit Michael of it. Michael Vick a statement today oh. is conceding all of these points. <laughs> Look, I absolutely did all this. Yeah. Hey, I got to uh, uh, get your attention here. Someone is telling us on the instant feedback. Uh, on the copyright thing, look at the beginning of the suit, the first paragraph. 
He has his name written with a copyright mark after it. Yes, there is and a little his C. Signature, his signature, too, at the bottom is... Yes. He's got... Uh, yes, he's copywritten his name. All right, and then what's the last one here? Plaintiff prays this court to give relief on these issues. Yes. And then uh, plaintiff... Uh, go ahead. Plaintiff uh, pays uh, prays this court will issue a temporary restraining order against Michael Vick so he can no longer sell my copyrighted material. Michael Vick can't steal any more of my animals... Dogs in parentheses uh, for, dog for, fighting. for dog fighting, as opposed to a, a cockatoo that he would steal for dog fighting. <laughs> this guy's a silly goose. Michael Vick has to stop physically hurting my feelings <laughs> and dashing my hopes. <laughs> he has dashed his hopes, and then he signs his name with the copyright. Respectfully thing. submitted. Yeah. <laughs> Douglas Niedermeyer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he got the copyright after his signature. There. Jonathan Lee Riches, copywritten. Oh, Physically hurting my feelings. <laughs> and then it's true, it says... I have dashed the hopes of one Jonathan Lee Riches on several occasions, and I'm sorry for that. I think oh. that... And then it does say Jonathan uh, Lee Riches, uh, copywritten. And then if you notice, number 40948-018-FCI... Federal Correctional Institution in Williamsburg. Uh, so, yes, he well, is why not? in prison. I got to say, not? I don't think that this lawsuit is really well grounded. I think it's probably. You know what, though? He was able to file it. It's filed and has to somehow be dealt with by the court. Whether it's just like a two Michael second to reading. Write, to write if I did it of all these charges, like a book of if I, if I did it. If I now, I would have microwave tested. By putting the sensors in his attic where he would never see them. If I did it. If I did it. Feel loud? Uh, we got our music. We got a, I got a heart on. We got to step out. Oh. Hey, uh, Robert Kelly Live. Dot com. What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? I got what do you got? the uh, Comedy Central Presents taping uh, August 24th at 6 o'clock. Go to my MySpace, click on the link, and get free tickets if you want to go. So we see, K, what do you got? What do you got? What do you yeah. got? Uh, chewed up my tour all over the country. Go to MySpace and please buy my DVD, Shameless. And go to YouTube and check out YouTube, your hilarious video. Jimmy, what do you got? What do you got? What do you got? I want someone to send me a photo. There's a billboard of me on the Jersey Turnpike. Yeah. Between exits 14 and 15, I think northbound. Please send me a photo of it. Bill Burr called me. I've not seen it yet. A lot of people calling every day. They, they've oh, seen really? it every morning. Yeah. Oh, I, I, and I, uh, I apologize, but I am going to have to miss the uh, second portion of the program. What? I have to go pick up my gal. What's going on? Where she's is she? going home Ooh. right away. Yeah. Well, it takes me an hour to get there. But she's ready to go right and now. And uh, they Just check out. Her. That's yeah. pretty crazy. Yeah. Can I use your kazoo? Uh, no. Make right. sure the kazoo and all my things that my mouth goes on get sterilized and packed away like they usually do. How about this, baby? <laughs> oh, you keep that filthy, dirty, Jim. I love it that way. It smells like mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we'll do. Uh, we'll fool around a little bit next. Fool around. Maybe I'll. Maybe I'll call in. How about you call in uh, from your car? That's always I'll fun. Call in from my car and you can immediately listen to me drive home. That's always good. We'll do that next. Give me the hotline number. All right, uh, guys. If you're not joining oh. us, have a great Great day. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. It's Whip Them Out Wednesday. Herbie and Anthony just got me wild. I just got wild. <laughs> we tell you how to get a wow sticker, but we can't plug the website. Opie and Anthony. The Opie and Anthony Show. It's Opie. It's Anthony, maybe in a car soon. It's Jim Norton. It's Louis C.K. And of course, it's Fat Bob Kelly who needed to go smoke in between fat, shows, and now we fat, can't find him. Fat smoking Poor Bob. Bob Kelly. Stupid Bob Kelly has to go smoke. Stupid fat. Not and possibly here. jerk off because we brought Tracy in, the new PD, mm -hmm. and he lost his mind. Uh, he, he turned into what? A 15 year old. Yeah. Oh, the one with the girl with the shorts? Uh, no, no, no. She, she's uh, she's an intern. Turn. Oh, okay. Uh, Tracy is the PD here in New York City. <laughs> Way to notice, Lou. I know. Wow. You know the shorts with the, with the legs. <laughs> Going way up to that. No, Tracy's the new PD here, and uh, she came in last week when Bob was in for Jimmy. And, and and Bob lost his mind. And as soon as she left, uh, he goes, that's my type. Oh, my God. I'm oh, yeah. my mind. oh, hi. Hi, Bob. I was just outside talking to Tracy. See, I told you. Ah, yeah. <laughs> what was she talking about? The, the fact that you're going to come in and we're going to do something? And it's just awful. Well, actually, I told her my fantasy. And Did I was, you really? I was actually on the money with probably four to five. 
Really? What, that you get to kiss her toes? Now that she doesn't want me to speak at all, and she wants me out before the birds chirp. She said that to you? No, I uh, I said that to her. My well, fantasy is almost like a, like, like um. I come over late. Yeah. I get the call. Yeah. Just come over. I go, okay. I show up. There's like a silk robe, panties, high heels. For you to wear. <laughs> <laughs> Laid out. Yeah. She's standing there smoking a long cigarette saying, put them on, faggot. Yeah. She has a strap on cock. <laughs> apparently, apparently we're on XM and apparently uh, yeah. you knew my fantasy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then uh, we come in and there's uh, candles lit. Uh-huh. And, um, Why are you whispering? Just yeah, talk. I'm not sure this is really. No, no, he's me. he's really worked up. He, All right. The, the the one thing I want to start by saying, when she came in and you had a little interaction with her, yeah. you lost your mind. You couldn't look at her. You were stammering. You were like, yeah. You didn't know what to do with your hands. You were trying to make believe you were eating food, but I there was knew. really no food around. I knew what to do with my hands. Trust me. Um, <laughs> yeah, she's. You haven't. There's just that type of woman. That type of girl she's your that type, you does said. it for me. Mm-hmm. Oh my what god. What does it? The big the big natural boobs. Just that she's a you know, she's a she's a woman. Yeah. I love yeah, the, women. You love women. All right, well. The women and I like the little the little freckles up here from you know too much sun. Yeah, mm-hmm. I like that little the little freckles, the chest freckles. Yeah. And uh oh sure. Her outfits are driving me nuts and that long hair and the beautiful lips and those eyes and that little attitude she has and she's probably very good uh as a lover. <laughs> Well, you were, you couldn't look her in her in her eyes though. Nah, I can't. You tried. I I, I yeah. made you. <laughs> I made you very uncomfortable. <laughs> like, look look at her eyes. <laughs> and you were able to do it for like a second or two, and then you had to look down again. Yeah, I got to look down. Plus, she's a very powerful woman in here. She comes in with a presence. You know Is what? Going to spank you? What? Um, actually, I think that if I was with her, um. No, I wouldn't want. I don't. I don't like to get spanked. I actually spanked myself once by accident. Yeah, but you would take a spanking from her. I would take a spanking. Yeah. I'd take a spanking I mean, even from if it's you. Not your, sure. Wait, I, can, but even if it's not her, your fantasy. Is. If she said, uh, "I want to spank you and shit on your bald head and rub it in," <laughs> you'd uh, you'd do it, right? If she said nothing, either I don't touch you or I just shit on your head and laugh at you. You'll be like, well, I get to see your ass. Is this your fantasy or is this her fantasy? Yeah, my yeah. fantasy is her doing that to you. <laughs> oh, really? What? Yeah. And Bob, what is she wearing? She's wearing just a silk robe. The silk robe, the pants. With no nothing on top, but her breasts aren't showing. They're they're covered. Mm. You understand? Almost like uh, taboo, like uh, Kay Parker and taboo. Exactly. And a little panties, because mm-hmm. I don't want to see everything right away. No. And uh, but then she cuts a, a hole in the panties and shits out of it <laughs> <laughs> onto your head, and then molds the shit into like a hairdo for into you. Into a shit hat, <laughs> so that you look like you got a shit, shit hair. hat. You were wearing a shit hairdo. We were looking at shit hat videos. Uh, about a week. <laughs> what is that? Don't even that? get us there again. Oh, and she yeah. shits so much she molds it into a beehive. Like a That's fucking, right. A net footed cello. We yeah, should, he we looks should. like he's in I, th- I just want to. I, I t- <laughs> we saw a shithead video. There was so much shit on this this chick's head that she couldn't keep her head up straight. It was like tilted. But has side. anybody ever but shit on somebody's head and then, t- like a bald guy like him that's clean bald and then and then fashioned it nicely and so it looks like that, you know, like a doll with plastic hair like uh, Bob the Builder? I'd love to have that. Thought. Like Bob the Builder? Yeah. <laughs> I had just shit right yeah. on my head. Yeah. yeah. Actually get like a comb and kind yeah. of make comb That's lines. That's what I mean. It. That's right. what I mean. Nice comb so, lines like, uh, like so Play-Doh hair. You talked to her about this outside the studio? Well, I kind of just told her. I asked her if she wanted to hear it, and she, she said I'll go. And she said, uh, and she put a couple rules down. There's no, you know, no, no uh, intercourse. Which God, his, I, his which, voice is shaking. He's really which, distracted <laughs> by this. Wait, which well, I'm into. Wait, why I, no intercourse? I, I'm, I'm, I'm looking. You know, I don't want intercourse at all. <laughs> I don't. I don't want to. One of our first meetings with her, she told Aunt and I, uh, I haven't been late in twelve years. Twelve years. Mm. Maybe she didn't want people to know that. Years. <laughs> 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 well, was it twelve years? Don't tell two radio hosts. Months, maybe. Wait, no. What did she tell us? It's not 12 months. years. You can't, oh, maybe, uh, you can't be that hot. And Wait, how long? 12 months. Why is she measuring uh, 12... her not laid like the way people talk about their babies? 12 oh, it... months. <laughs> What was I'm in my second trimester of not <laughs> no, getting no, 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 no. in my exactly. pussy. She hasn't been with a white guy in 12 years. Oh, well, oh there you go. There you go. Wait, she's got to come in here now because now I'm not sure. No wonder Bob doesn't want to. You can't follow that. 12 years of black Dude, I can't follow you. It's true. I got a rod right now. Oh, you do. Say Alice. He's got a big piece. All right, let's uh, let's talk about... Uh, so, do you think she shaves or no? What? I think she shaves everything. But you, but you, why, why are you whispering now? Yeah, why is it? Why do you, why do, why do you get a whisper? Um, I, I hope not. I don't like a whole. I do not. I hate 
a shaved pussy. Fuck I want you. a, I want I a like little patch. Either. Oh, oh, I hate it. I queers. fucking hate it. <laughs> I want it to be fucking <laughs> I want, bald. My, I, I want it to look like a profile of Alfred Hitchcock's face. <laughs> Just a fucking <laughs> big, <laughs> meaty <laughs> fucking... <laughs> so, no. so basically what you're saying <laughs> is you want a cock with no hair. No. I don't All right, Bob. Bob. Yes. So what else was, uh, what are some of the other rules? The, uh, no intercourse. No intercourse. Yeah. Uh, and I have to leave. Uh, I can't stay. So what do you got, what are you going to get done with her? I'm going to get done a lot. I, you know, well, use some did toys. Did you explain that part? Use some toys. All right, you'll use. Actually put one in my mouth. You clear? Oh, God. That looks kind of silly. This guy. Do, you want, do you want to be a cuckold for her? Like, what What's a cuckold? It's just so weird that a beautiful a woman inspires you to put on a negligee and fuck your own mouth with a dildo. <laughs> <laughs> like Look at her tits. I want to fuck my own face with a rubber cock. Wait, Louis has a gift. <laughs> How nice her tits Wait, are. What are you, you you're, want probably, the, you're probably good at Sudoku, too, huh? just putting the pieces together. I don't Bobby, know what that is. Uh, you want the dildo in your mouth, Sorry. and then you're going to work her over that way? No, it was actually a joke. I wouldn't put the dildo in my mouth and work uh, her over. I'd just suck it. Um. <laughs> Wait, would you would you be a cuckold for her? Like, What the hell is a cuckold? I'm explaining to you. Okay, sorry. If, 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 if I didn't mean to jump likes in to be throat. humiliated, like if she's with black guys, she likes black guys. No. Like to be able to watch and be taunted. Mm -mm. I've been watching videos like that. No. I've never been into interracial porn, mm -hmm. but boy, am I into it lately. You mean so a woman is with a black guy, and then there's another white guy? They're going, look at you, look no, at no, you she, with that no, black guy. No, 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 her, is that what it is? her father's just holding no, no. his chest like. No. Yeah. the guy watching has a relationship with the girl that's getting banged. She's being right. fucked by a big cock, and she's taunting the guy a little bit. And some girls are corny. But who's, the, who's taunting? She's the woman taunting. is taunting the white guy. Oh, saying, look at look at how this. Yeah, even if she's fucking another this white guy, guy it's me. not the racial thing. It's just the idea that yeah. she's being such a slut and humiliating the guys with. But this one girl is so good. I forget her name, but she's always. Like uh, you like that? You like watching me, little bitch? You like watching me, bitch? And she's fucking taunting uh, this guy. It's so, and she's sucking this giant dick mm. and taunting the guy she's with. Mm -hmm. It's really just funny. when I think okay. you can't go any further, Norton. That's not that you, dirty you find yet. something out. You are actually they, have to go backwards now. You are they all actors? I don't. See, that would yeah, take me out of it. I would, yeah, I would need to know a, that there's yeah. some kind of realism to this thing. Like, yes. oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They have to prove that they're they're actually a couple, well, and then and I would get, the maybe get into thing that. Is is, psycho is psychological? You watch just... them, you see that they're really people. They're they're not real. Right. Actors. Some of them are porn actors, but the majority of them are not. They're average looking people. Yeah, because anytime you watch a porn and they're doing that thing, especially porn now. At least back in the day, they would actually act out the scene as much mm -hmm. as best as they could. Now they'll do the scene half ass, and then she'll laugh and. She'll She'll, she'll say something funny because she yeah, just improv the line. They giggle the whole time because they're about to fuck. Yeah. There's no real, yeah. All right, we're trying to get did, Tracy in studio. Did you ever see it. porn bloopers, by the way? Yes. I have, We were talking about porn bloopers about two weeks ago. It's it such a people. funny one. They do a scene and it's actually well acted. The, this girl was blowing this guy. Two girls sucking oh. cock. One girl had the cock in her hand and then it, just out of nowhere just takes this huge cock and just slaps the other chick in the face. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. I would love to see uh, porn <laughs> bloopers. I, I've never seen them. It's on you porn. Type in porn bloopers. This chick's just right. sucking a con. She goes crack, and the other goes ooh. My, yeah. <laughs> I, my friend, uh, she does porn, and uh, I forget what. And, oh, is he on the other phone? Yeah, we've been trying to get to him for oh, five Anthony. minutes. Sorry, yeah. Anthony. I, I was just listening to the conversation, and when the, when that when those movies are uh, are real and not movies, it's called a home invasion. <laughs> there you go. I, I don't like Anthony. Already missed. Anthony's seat being empty. That's weird. Hey, Anthony. Yeah. Ant, we're doing a little. Uh, everyone's moving up a chair here. Uh, Jimmy, why don't you move over to Anthony's? All right. Oh. Louie, why don't you move over to Jimmy's uh, spot? And Bob, okay. why don't you go to the couch? I'm going to have to. Oh, Bob. <laughs> go to the couch, Bobby. All right, nice talking to you. <laughs> if, I could, if, I had, if I had Anthony's button, I'd push it right now. <laughs> Already. Someone's and Tracy's fucking up the program. Look at this idiot. No, 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 you fucked up. I get to go, asshole. I Wait. fucking hate New York this time, driving. Why? Speaking of, uh, th this is not acting. This is Anthony every day of his life driving home. Anthony, where are you? This fucking guy, I'm on Van Damme. And this right. dumb fucker was trying to make a left turn, so... He blocks the entire lane that I'm in uh, by, by trying to make a left turn. Just Nobody likes a tattletale except, of course, me. Oh, my God, no. Can you, can you get next to him and uh, get him to talk on the air? Oh, like, he already can... did the turn. I, I'll oh, okay. get people to yell, believe me. I get people yelling at me all the time. The savage fucking uh, drivers that drive these, uh, these uh, black cars. 
the right. uh, taxing limousine service, uh, not the yellow cabs, but the black car drivers. <laughs> yeah. They are of course, the town cars, horrid drivers. When when they get shot and they are found slumped over a wheel, I laugh because I cannot Tee-hee. stand them. They they're way worse than cabs. Fucking paperwork. They're filling up paperwork, and the light's green. It's an arrow. There's a gap of five cars in front of them, and I miss the light because this guy is fucking filling out. I had to go to blah, 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 blah. Now those whining. Stop it. (laughs) Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. (laughs) Jimmy's working your buttons. Audience, right now, if Jimmy has that sound effects machine, <laughs> oh, it's going to be a long, long hour and a half. But that, uh, well, dude, are, are, are you are you still in the actual intersection? No, I got past that, dude. I don't sit and fucking, I don't sit there like, what do I like do? Like discipline. <laughs> I'm sidewalking it. I do whatever it takes to get around fucking assholes. I break. The- <laughs> <laughs> I am above the law. I don't pay attention to lights. I don't yep. pay attention to speed limits. Yep. And hey, why is your phone crapping out? You know what's weird? Like, Anthony was just here 20 minutes ago in a very happy uh, mood considering that, you know, <laughs> his chick went through some, the, the some minor surgery. Now he's in his car, and this is like, your whole mood has changed, sir. Outside of the hall and tunnel, miserable. Yeah. This fucking... These New York and Jersey cocksuckers that have no concept that there are other people on the road that want to get somewhere. Like, well, you know, you know, it's you know, it's them. You know, it's them. You are never to blame. <laughs> oh my God, Jimmy. Jesus, that's <laughs> terrible. Like, no has anywhere to be. They're just out here to fuck with me. Why don't they drive fast? How come if they... Do they ever look at the flashing walk-don't-walk sign and realize that light's going to turn fucking uh, red in a minute or in a couple of seconds? Why don't I get through so that the guy behind me maybe could get through too? No, but they leave 18 car lengths in front of them, and the second it turns yellow, they sit, they hit the gas, and they get through and I get stuck. Why don't it... Sign with the snapper. What? Yeah. Go ahead, Ant. Hit the gas earlier, and we can all get through. But these boring. Other... What? <laughs> oh, got a boring. I hit the wrong button. No, I meant to hit. Uh... How do I, I switch banks on this fucking thing? No one's helping me. I'm... I was helping trying you? to hit. I was trying to hit what? What? That was it. Very complicated. <laughs> what? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Now, now here we go. We get on the expressway, and of course, on this on ramp that's as long as a runway, you have to do 20 miles an hour because uh, no- <laughs> it's the highway. Oh, here we go. You here know, this go. is like, this is like, um, this is like your traffic report. Yeah. It's an irritated fucking guy right. who hates people. Let's see what's going on on the roads. These motherfuckers. <laughs> Louis, we used to tape ourselves uh, coming to work. Mm-hmm. Oh, it was some. Of the, it was a lot of fun. Dude, you want to beep your crap. horn? <laughs> I like then they'll the move. Anthony. You fucking, you fucking Jersey cunt. This guy looks at me. He thinks he's going to be all fast with me. He wanted to cut in front of me. I didn't let him. And now he's looking at me like I'm a fucking douchebag. You fucking, F- oh, if I could use racial epithets. Lean out the window and go. Good evening. <laughs> <laughs> now he's nowhere to be out. Come on, come on, douchebag. Dude, Look, you won't let set- Dude, you gotta relax. You, you have a heart attack. Just relax, man. Just tell the guy just to relax and try the wine. <laughs> <laughs> have a drink together. Uh, I'm in the I'm I'm in I'm in the uh, white painted like part where you're not supposed to be. There we go. No, nope, stay there. There we go. I don't like people that can come up on their ass and right when you decide to go around and they decide it's time to get out of the way. Well, that scared me. I heard a siren. I thought I was being pulled over. <laughs> So the other guy's bothering you, right? He stinks, and I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> well, we, we lost you. What? We lost you. We lost you for a second. Oh, I'm still here. I said I'm never around the problem long. I yell, and then I'm I'm 80 miles an hour past them. You just, you just, you, after someone fucks over, you just kind of go. Go ahead, go and leave, leave. I pardon you. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you that they're fucking. You want know this dude? They're driving expensive cars. Goddamn rich cunt. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> so childish. This fucking rules. Hey, how, is, is there a lot of cars out there? At what do we got going on? Uh, yeah, it, it's packed. Uh, watch yeah. yourselves in. That could be a problem. Yeah. Uh, but uh, I, I'm, I seem to be moving along at a pretty good pace right now. They seem a little more relaxed. You're on your way. Are you yeah, in the tunnel yet? Way. Uh, I'm okay, except for these cabs that are in the left lane for no reason, doing, let's see, 50 miles an hour. We're on the expressway, 70 at least. And they get this attitude like, I'm going fast enough. No, you're not. Look how close I am to you. Yeah, no, if there's somebody behind you that's close to your bumper, you're not going fast enough. Yeah. Oh, could you get out of the way? Holy Jesus, fuck. Get Stop, out of whining. The <laughs> Stop whining. Stop oh whining. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> fuck you, Hulk. Schwarzenegger. <laughs> <laughs> oh, did you see that jerk? <laughs> uh, dude, well, you know what? You 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 you, you got to relax, dude. You're in traffic. You just you know. Act like wherever you are, that's the place to be. <laughs> place to be. And I'm not in traffic. I'm in like cars that don't know to get the fuck out of the left lane. You Boring. dick. Shut up. I I. This cab has got to move. <laughs> you dick. I love this button. <laughs> I don't have to I say anything. Yeah, you know what I'm afraid of? Jimmy is not going to want to give that up. I don't already. Yeah. This sucks. This sucks. He was I call fucking I love this machine. And he was calling the guy in your way a dick, by the yeah, way. Yeah, not you. Not you. Uh, we'll give, him, we'll give uh, him a machine with one button that works. Just one. One lousy button will give him. Why not? Just called. I, I, I actually want my own machine. I think I can really contribute. No. I know how to do this. Oh my God. No. Penis. Show. Hey, uh, Jimmy. Um, Jimmy's like kind of sitting at your seat, Amp. He's also yeah. fiddling with your your whistles and stuff. No, don't yeah. fiddle. I swear. <laughs> I'm gonna just have all new ones, and I won't use not, them until I get. Dude, I'm dude. I'm not doing. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait! Unless you well, what, what, what? what do you need? Just make sure the girl doesn't come in. Oh, all right. Uh oh. Oh, I, your no. bell is gonna get rung um, oh, by his little God. little Willie oh. bell ringer. Oh, he's, oh. he's ringing the bell. Oh. He's ringing the bell with his penis, Anthony. Oh. Ringing the bell. I couldn't. With his I couldn't head. stop him. His big oh. mushroom head was pounding oh. down on your bell. He just checked into the hotel with his cock. <laughs> oh no! He just paged the bellboy with his panacea. Anthony, use it with a fart. Huh? No, I, I didn't. Oh, dude, you got to make the whistle blow by uh, using a fart. No, I'm not. I, I don't have to fart. <laughs> I well, us. Hey, let it be known that. Hold on, let it be known that. Whistle's Steve going in the just asshole. Just handed Jimmy the the whistle. Oh, the whistle is in his asshole. Oh. The whistle's in his ass, uh, Anthony. I, yeah. I, I try to He's stop. Gonna make it whistle. Yeah. Make it whistle. He's gonna try to make it whistle. Let's it's, go. It's roller skating time, everybody. I don't have to. I'm not gonna make it whistle. Make it whistle. Why not? Well, we're I taking guess. pictures of Anthony's whistle and Jimmy's butt crack. Oh God, dude, oh, you can God. reuse this. Oh, you can hear the little balls. <laughs> <laughs> he just he just dropped it out of his ass without using his hands. Uh, oh, it's now on the couch. Can you <laughs> fart hard enough to ring that bell? I wonder. Like, no, I can't. I, I don't have to cut a gasser at all, actually. No. no. You can you shit and let it drop on top of the bell? Oh, what's rings. that? What's that, Ant? Does he have a gasser that can blow the whistle? No, okay. I was gonna try that, but I, I didn't. So for myself. <laughs> what oh. if you use the horn to, with the bubble end there and blow air into your asshole? With that horn. And see if your eyes bulge out. Yeah. And see if it farts back out again. Our anus. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I don't want I don't want to mess with that because that's expensive. What is? I don't want to fuck with this oh, bullhorn. Oh yeah, don't don't mess with the bullhorn. Just the just the bell. Yeah. Just the bell. I Here. Will, All right. Believe me, I will send out a lowly intern and make him get me new everything. Uh we already knew that, but we figured it would be fun uh, for five minutes for the show. Uh, <laughs> Wait, what is he doing? He's putting his balls inside Wait, of what? the bell of that horn. 
He's ringing the. He's blowing the horn onto his balls. <laughs> he's, he's got his two peaches that, stuffed in your horn. <laughs> stuffed in, like a couple of hairy melons in a tuba. Uh, that, was, that was almost like a cartoon. Oh my god! <laughs> That's how bugs would stop the, the guy from beeping shit. the horn. There you go. All right. Well, you might want to throw that on the couch. I though. freed it up. What? Yeah. <laughs> Throwing it all away. It gets thrown away. Well, you can reuse. You should reuse that whistle, though. That'd be a fucking great moment. Oh, you can sell bet. that on eBay, that horn. It's had your balls in it. When I put it in my mouth and say how familiar it tastes. <laughs> <laughs> all right, and how's the ride? Good? Uh, yeah, we're, we're doing good. I, I could just sit here and, you know, you guys do a show. I'll chime in. <laughs> oh, <you're> all right. <laughs> Food. All right. All right, why don't we bring Tracy in here? All right. And uh, Bob, in between shows, talk to Tracy about his uh, little fantasy. Yeah. You know, obviously, bo obviously, Bob's got the girlfriend and stuff, but this is like that window shopping thing. You're just kind of taking yeah. a peek and, this is and speaking your mind a little bit. Now it's not like, you know. but but it's funny because we we didn't do this on the radio, but in between shows, Tracy did come in and Bob did lose his shit. Yeah. He really did lost he his old? mind. So. Was it huh? like Sam Bob Zombie? Uh, close. Yeah. I hope he described the Sam thing uh, for everybody. He looked like kind of like a newborn fawn. He couldn't stand up without <laughs> holding on to anything. <laughs> Little rickety legs. He, <laughs> he was shaking so bad his knees, knees were just wobbling. Knees bending outwardly. Yeah. <clears throat> his mother's licking really like the first time you after get birth laid. off his face. Shaky, kind of nervous thing. That's what he looked like. Right. Oh, by the way, Anthony, good news. Yeah. We got a uh, we got a sweeper. Anthony's fucking traffic report. It just came in oh. from Tim. Let's take a listen to this here. Uh, it's Anthony's fucking traffic report. I'm the Obi Anthony show. There you go. All right. Hey, uh, Tracy, why don't you sit on the couch there? Yelling. Tracy, our fine PD here in uh, New York City for 92.3 K-Rock. You're on the XM show, so you get cursing stuff. Hi, Trace. Well, that's good because I really can't control my language. Uh -huh. So they, Bobby said that he had discussed... Um, his thing with you. Oh, it's more of my fantasy. fantasy. He said that he was sharing some of his fantasies. And with what, what, what exactly was it? What did he say? You better get your head and your ass wired together or I will take a giant shit on you. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not exactly what he said. No, no, that's, <laughs> okay. that's way off. Hey, hey, Bob, will you look at her? Please? I'm trying to. Yeah, but, uh, Bob, Bob was nervous. He said, uh... So are you about a size 14? <laughs> <laughs> but it was, very, it was very generous, I think, that you let him share it with you. His in fantasy. front of a whole bunch of people too. That all. Oh. Wait, how did it go about? He walked really up to you and just said, "This is my fantasy." No, 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 no. What did you exactly say? I well, you on the mouth. <laughs> God. She, she. I was outside smoking, and she actually turned the corner, and uh, she turned the corner. Yeah, she turned the corner. Why? Why? What? Uh, yeah, he sees it so dramatic. Was oh, her no. hair blown in the wind? That, actually, there was a little breeze, which mm -hmm. is weird because there's no breeze out mm -hmm. there today. Mm -hmm. And uh, she turned the corner, and uh, she said, uh, "She goes, she goes, you got a light stud." Mm -hmm. and then she started singing the song, "You better wake up" or something like that, mm -hmm. like Greece, I think. But yeah. no, then she uh, she turned the corner, and I just I I you know I said. Uh, I have a fantasy. Can I tell you? Show me how you suck a guy's cock. The legs on my head. I was close. Uh, close. Uh, not right to that point right away. I mean, I kind of, you know, um, I said, uh, she said, yeah, go ahead, with kind of an attitude, which actually made me more turned on. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, if you say the wrong thing, I might punch you in the face. Right. <laughs> Which I liked. Yeah, um, yeah. Look at her, not me. I can't, because Norton's does she say chin or lack thereof is in the way. Did she say anything to you? This is a giant cock. <laughs> <laughs> no, she didn't say that. Trust me. You've no, seen my cock. He <laughs> told me it was the size of a thumb, which kind of just ruined the whole thing at that moment. So. Oh. Yeah, yeah well, no. I mean, it's, it's a fist and, and a thumb. Maybe. Hey, you, you told us uh, it's been a while since you had sex, and I, I might have blew up your spot by saying it's been 12 years, and I, I guess that's wrong. 12 years? 12 years. 20 months. 20 months. All right. 20 months. Why? Oh, 12 Why years is, is way too long. Why 20 months? Because I'm picky. Okay. 
Because you're what? I'm picky. Oh, oh, picky. It's the voice, too. You hear the voice? Yeah. You like yes. the voice, Oh, Bob? she smokes like a pack a day. So when oh, you were telling great. her all your fantasies, were you doing with the the blueberry that's stuck in between your teeth all morning? <laughs> Do I have one? Yes. <laughs> oh, my God. You know, can I just say something, though? It's not like that's going to deter detract right. from my face and my tits. you got a big-ass blueberry, big blueberry, I'd, I'd blueberry fucking... skin on it yeah. in yeah. the middle of his teeth. If that, that, that's actually going to help me. Yeah. It's going to actually detract. It's going to make her focus on that dumb tooth <laughs> rather than my tits and my stomach. Oh, come on. You look good, Bobby. Relax. You're a swell-looking fellow. Hey, yeah, Bobby. What, what so size are your tits is what I want to know. I actually have. Oh. No, it's all right. That's, I like that. That's nice. We, yeah. can, we can play around. We can, you know, have fun. Um, Share uh, bras. Uh, I have uh, one. Well, there's no need to get mean. But, uh, geez. Well, that's what she was getting at. And I was trying to protect you, but you what? said no problem here. So there you go. I was talking about your man boobs with Tracy. <laughs> well, you don't have to fucking you turn know, on me either. <laughs> I'm probably, and I'll go in with you. I, Bob and I probably have legitimate bra sizes. We just don't yeah. know what they are. But I'm sure that I don't know. I'm probably a 34B or something. I'm probably a 36B. Yeah. Um, and once a month a C. Mm -hmm. uh, what it? <laughs> did, did we have some Anthony? Anthony, we couldn't hear you, bro. Anthony. Yeah, this is going just like the uh, fantasy that uh, Bobby was spelling out before uh, the break. Uh, mm -hmm. Just like it. Talking about your man tits with the girl instead of all the... Uh, that sexy shit you were talking about earlier. <laughs> yes, right. Exactly. Yeah, the key word would be fantasy. So, Bob, why do you like uh, Tracy? Tell her to her face. It's it's she. Ha you know what she has? She, Stand up, Tracy. And, and she has this. Remember back, like, um, who was the chick that was in Superman? Oh, Margot Margo, Kidder. Margo Kidder. You remember how she hot took, she was? You mean when she took her Kidder was a dog. No, I'm going to tell you. Teeth out <laughs> dog. What is wrong with you? Let's, uh, let's, uh, Tracy, let's. Tracy, I apologize for our friend. Let's, let's, let me finish. Margot Be Kidder was a kook. Hang on. Yeah, she's a kook now. She but took her front teeth out and hung out in people's backyards. Yeah, and now. Is that the answer you come out pools? with? No. No, there's that look of that woman when they had. It, w it was like uh, the the natural hair and long and it's 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 she's just all natural but she's a woman. There's something just she's she's just gorgeous. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? And it's laughing at you. She's all natural and she's a woman. Oh, what well. do you like? All natural men usually? I'm kind of no, nervous. No, <laughs> uh, yeah, obviously. Right, totally... She's actually standing in the pose that I had in my fantasy when she opened the door. Oh really? Yeah, like that. All, all she's missing is the robe. Yeah. No, she's uh, <laughs> it's completely sexy. You're right. Yeah, there's something about her, man. It's just, it's look well, at her. Well, because also she's, uh, I mean, I don't know. We gotta be. I don't want to. I guess you're nervous too. <laughs> no, I just don't want to because some women don't like to hear it. But because she's older, she's she. You're not 21, right? So she owns the sexuality. She just right. goes. You can tell that when she put these clothes on, she said, "These are gonna make my tits look nice, and these shoes make my legs very fuckable." So right. I'm put them on. <laughs> Wait a phrase it, Lou. She's, <laughs> but she owns it because yeah. uh, it's her power, and she's not. Yeah. Uh, Bobby says in the morning. What? That? He, he, Bobby says that when he puts his shoes on, they're going to make my legs look fuckable. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't look at Tracy like that. We work together. It's a professional relationship, and I respect what well, she does. I want a program director. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I'm being a really good sport here. So you are. <laughs> yes, you are. I don't. I just want to. I don't want to do that. I just want you to open the door in that outfit, and hey, hey, you know, Tracy. Not to change subjects, but did you have a problem with Miss Jones? Did I have a problem with her? Yeah. Not at all. Well, would, do you know uh, Black Voices <laughs> at AOL dot com? Tracy, last name, former uh, bigwig who ran Hot 97, is portrayed as a low-down, lying, celebrity-seeking bitch who often criticized Miss <laughs> Jones's show without offering any tools. Is that? And? Is there yeah. something there? No, she's trying to sell books. Who's that? Miss Jones. Oh, you're in her book? Yeah. And what does she say about you? Basically what you just said. What the... Who's Miss Jones? Oh, we're gonna get into that on the other side. She's uh, she's a radio host here. Oh, uh, you just gave us a nice little little thing to talk about who on the threw other side. Toddle into the fucking what is she? The tsunami. Fast yes. Oh, uh, we'll get into that tsunami Tracy. song. That was that chick. You got you oh, got some. Listen, I've been trashed in so many books and on so many radio shows. At this point, it have doesn't really? even matter. Yeah, but you got some pit bulls now. Trust me, we're gonna have some fun. So with I got that. some backup. Uh, sure. right, you got some pit bulls that, that are you going to have a lot of fun with what I just read in the coming weeks? <laughs> well, Miss Jones, Miss Jones. Liar whore, liar whore, you know it. 
There you go. Exactly. <laughs> For the record, I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. All right, so let's uh, wrap up this fantasy thing. What else there, Buff? You like the boobies? What else? The hair? Well, you the got, eyes? What uh, you it's got? exactly what it is. Oh, he likes your freckly boobs, too, he said. Well, they're just the chest. I like those little freckles. Like, because you've been in the sun. You know, you like you lay it in your backyard or on your roof or something like that. Topless on Reese Park. Are you kidding me? No. Mm. Dude, I might... Wait, you go topless in a, in a what? On Reese Park. Where What's is that? that? It's right between Brooklyn and Queens. Where? Can you give me Kingston? Is it a, you want directions? Wait, yes. is, is <laughs> and it I a, want dates. Hold on, hold on. Is it a nude beach? No, anywhere in New York. It's so legal. do you see the kids kind of hanging around you? There's other topless does women. It, does stuff. it bother you that there's vans of old men with popcorn just staring at you? No. No? It, it turns around. So if a guy stares at you while you're out naked, with topless, I should say, and a guy, you know dudes are looking at you, you have no problem with that. I'm kind of oblivious to it. I'm just like in my own world, not paying attention. Does it? Does no, it honestly, thing. please answer me. Is there any part of you that was like... Wait, you're oblivious to people this is looking very, at you as you're topless? A, That's such a lie. I'm big, serious. I'm sitting there reading or listening to the station. I'm not paying you attention. You know guys are looking at you if you're topless. Yeah, but she's a strong and self-possessed woman, so they don't have any power over her with their looks. Like, it's one thing. If a guy can look at a woman's tits... And make her feel differently. That's him having power over her. But, she but she's perfect. got. She's a strong person yeah. who doesn't care. It's like somebody looking at your face. Like I don't care. You're looking at my face. I don't give a shit. She's got perfect. her tits. She knows yeah. they're great. She puts them in the sun. Perfect. She enjoys perfect. the feeling of the warm sun on her tits. They're perfect. That guy can go fuck himself. <laughs> yeah, that's what I say. Fuck him too. That guy's, and that's what that guy's Bob, me. But Bob fuck. wants. Bob <laughs> is turned on by that indifference. Also, hold on. We got info in this park. E Rock, you know something about this park? That she uh, uh, the, the sunbathes topless in? Yeah, it, it is actually kind of common where it is. It's over in the Rockaways. Thank you. Wait, it's a common thing for the girls to be topless in? Yes. Yeah. So it is a common thing. I've heard that. Can guys take out their shtaminkis? No. <laughs> and that's all you got, e rock. And are there pervs just kind of hanging around there because they can see topless women? Um, it depends on the time of year because sometimes there's a lot of families around that area. But uh, for the most part, there is a lot of uh, older gentlemen just uh, perusing the beach with their metal detectors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're, but they're there the night before dropping Ooh, a shitload of nickels. It's like, yeah. Mm. Ooh, I found a nipple ring. <laughs> Are you a lot of nipple rings on that beach. <laughs> you don't have any piercings, right? I do. You do? Can I guess where? You can guess. I don't think I'll be able to tell you, but you can Well, guess. she doesn't wear a bra, so obviously no nipple rings. I would say ears and belly button. Nah, she goes a little crazier than that. I would say clitoris. Clitor cl clitoral hood. I would say uh, above the labia. I would say... Uh, just Are you expecting me to answer? No, you can do whatever you want. <laughs> okay. I, I told you. It's she all goes right. belly button, you. obviously, right? Ears and belly button. You got a little belly button uh, ring. That's yeah, that's obvious. Button. Oh, look oh. at that stomach. That's, that's great. Damn look good at that stomach. stomach. Oh, are you out of your mind? <laughs> God, that makes me angry. Why? She's a lovely lady. It's I. I want to. Oh, I want to bite a pencil. <laughs> that friggin' stomach is just oh insane. Her. Uh, she's just. And she's a woman. Yes. Imagine showing up. You know she'd have oh some cool music I never heard of on. <laughs> Some, uh, some tribal beast. Yeah, some type of like jazzy tribal thing mm -hmm. she got when she visited Africa on a tour and whenever she was there. And mm -hmm. oh, is that oh God bless. And everything about you is natural. Can that I say or, that? Or the last time she went to a puff daddy party. <laughs> oh Jesus, exactly. negative. She oh. likes the. She likes the. You know what? She likes the blanks. She likes blacks. Oh, you like black dudes? Yeah, oh, I'm definitely. We'll definitely not have sex then. That's her. Well, we weren't having sex anyway, but I, ah, it's, it's not like, like the fact that she's doing with black guys is what ruined it. Yeah, but if you're, yeah, if she's doing. You black were three guys, black dicks away from fucking. You could officially her. have That's sex true. with her and, and three it's black not dicks. Sex. Three black dicks ago, she would have. What are you well, saying? My there, dick is small, her vagina is oh, huge. I don't black. know what you're saying. Is there a reason for that? Or is it something you always like? This is a giant cock. <laughs> is there a reason for black guys, or you know, just the guys you always like? No, it was just that that was the social circle I moved in, and that's who I met. And this was a long time, so when you, those are the people you deal with, those are the people you meet, those are the people you end up dating. Right. So what are you dealing with now? Nobody. You have no social circle. 20 months she went. 20 months. I have a rabbit. A rabbit? Prison? <laughs> yeah. Is he still on the phone? Yeah, he just said, is your social circle basically prison? <laughs> is that, what you, would you work in a cafeteria? <laughs> I had a hairnet on. <laughs> so do you like, do you like white guys too, or is this just... Uh, yeah, I mean, sure. 
She I likes know. a rabbit right That's now. That's convincing. And we're talking about these. I don't know why she isn't hooked up in 20 what's months. The, That's what's the so name long. of your uh, vibrator there? The iVibe Rabbit, and it's purple. The i what? iVibe. Is that the, the rabbit? The iVibe Rabbit. Do you have any glass dildos? No. I, I swear to God, That's I thought she meant an animal. No, <laughs> the rabbit. The I rabbit is a very popular a sex toy. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, know. there's many different versions. Mm, I have. Yeah. You're doing it with that thing. That looks scary. What thing? We got a copy of the iVibe Rabbit. Look at this thing, Blue. <laughs> the hell? Uh, looks like nice. a cell phone. <laughs> it looks like a cell phone. <laughs> it looks like you call somebody on that fucking She's thing. She's fucking a yeah. cell, the original cell phone Jesus. with the battery pack. Yeah. How many minutes you get with that thing? <laughs> You're not... Jesus, you can make a smoothie. Rubbing your clit off. You can make a smoothie with that. It, it really... gets caught on the piercing, though. You could crush ice and make a little smoothie. It looks like you bought it from a Mr. See? Softy truck. See, she just gave you a little tip where the other piercing was, but you weren't listening. I already like, knew where it was. You're a bad listener. I knew where it was. Oh. I called it. All right. Well, wow. What do you do with that thing? I mean, I, I mean, that's crazy. Do you fight like uh, gladiators with that? <laughs> wow. Do you ever feel? <laughs> <laughs> no one's getting great at those buttons. Do you ever feel silly when you're using the iVibe Rabbit's vibrator? Silly. Why would I feel silly? Was it tell jokes? Because well, it looks kind of. <laughs> it doesn't. It looks kind of robotic. See, that's yeah, how it looks like. A, but it, it has a big, like a square. Box that shows how. That's how unvisual women are. It does, she doesn't. That's how little appeal a penis actually has. It could be fucking purple with gray buttons on it <laughs> yeah. and an LED display, it and, and it's just as good as a cock. It is purple. That's what I'm yeah. saying. Yeah. yeah. This it, is tall, fancy top for a whore. It could actually have Don Knotts' face on it. Yeah. She, it wouldn't She's matter. Like, fine. Yeah. As long as it didn't have yours. It's Bob. Not like a like, Wait, wait. Go about. back to that picture. It looks like a. Why we got a <laughs> Jesus? It looks like we got to cut me out. I mean, it looks like a remote for your TV too. How many? Yeah. How many? Can you change your channels with that thing in between really, sessions? You can like, program it, says, it to change your cable and it says, open your garage. Uh -huh. What's the hype? It's a vibrator designed after the iMac computer. Hey, Lou, you like the iMac, yes, right? Yeah. All right. And comes in the same array of colors, the oh, iVibe like Rabbit. The old, it's like the old Blueberry iMacs when they were like blueberry and raspberry the, the colors. Has nice. advanced IC chip technology that allows you perfect control over your pleasure. How it's supposed to be used, although it does make a pretty... Centerpiece, you kick back, send it in, turn it on, and enjoy all its wild pleasures. Mm. Send it in UPS. Mm -hmm. And uh, the best parts for, first and foremost, it's power. Power. If wanted to, those rabbit ears can go all crazy on your clit. Mm. Speaking of the rabbit, it has been attached to the shaft so it could flex back. Now you can insert all seven inches. You go for the all seven? I'm not answering this question. All right. Uh, mm -hmm. All seven inches of the <laughs> goes, oh, oh, goes, okay. <laughs> <laughs> like, Everybody can go over there, there's two of them taped together. Right. <laughs> I'm not really sure how... On the end of a broomstick? I'm not really Why, sure how Bob? far I can take I was just trying to add funny to funny. <laughs> don't take it that far because Tom will Gilding kill me. Gilding the lily a little. Yeah, we can't. We can't. Yeah, we're not really sure how far we can take it because yeah, technically she's our boss. Yeah, yeah let's... Come on, Bob. I don't, I don't, actually, she would never give us a problem. It would be Tom. But that's Tom would give us some kind of sick joke. Do you want to hear my fantasies about Tom? Hold on, let me... Yes, I fantasize about his tie. Hold on, here we go. Seven inches of shaft without worrying about whether or not the rabbit ears will lie up against your clit. A major improvement from the classic jackrabbit. Do you agree? Oh, that thing was such a pain in the ass, right? You had to worry about how the ears. You hated the jackrabbit. You know what? The batteries kept dying really quickly. Hey. This one has more staying power. It's wow. a convenient all-in-one toy. There's no separate controller or battery compartment to keep track of. It's all at the base of the vibrator. Her neighbors think she's been doing renovation for ten years. <laughs> <laughs> what is she doing in there? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, hey, you gotta, and they suggest you hold on to it, Harry Carey style. They're, they're suggesting it's you, bone. you use the vibrator, Harry Carey style. Harry Carey, oh, I see. They have ones with remote controls, too. Yeah. All right. You know, those glass dildos are great, though. How far away do you get from your vagina that you need a remote control? <laughs> All right, now we're taking across the room. Bit too far. <laughs> Jesus, how many black You're guys have you? You're talking about a remote with? control vibrator. <laughs> yeah, can Am you I take supposed it to off? ask you about the weather after that? <laughs> <laughs> Any follow-up to that question is disgusting. You know, Lou, <laughs> you can't. Yeah. You have to realize that you yeah. can't. We can't. To our boss, we can't talk to. I don't work here. Fuck you. You look like assholes right now, man. Sorry, you're right. All right, keep going. What is, is there anything else on this page worth uh, mentioning? Yeah, at some point I actually have to go and do some work. Uh, yeah. She's uncomfortable. She's a little... Yeah, she's going to go. No, I'm being really good Look, about this. Really? Oh, you're fantastic. Look. And that's why I love you. Hold on, hold on. Say, music's playing. You're cool. <laughs> this is what K-Rock's playing. Say, you're all right. 
Oh, boy, Green Day. Haven't heard them in a while. Uh, <laughs> hey, when do you think? Yeah. Doesn't sound anything like their old stuff. No, no, no. <laughs> hey, yeah, uh, a lot of work to do today. All right. Uh, yes. Uh, uh, we're, all right. Gate rape. Uh, play 11. Right. When, when, uh, when the... do you take over the music? What do you mean? Like, you, are they still programming out of Los Angeles? No, no, she's been doing it. The, okay. Her big decision is what to follow up the Green Day record with. Right. Should I go with Red Hot Chili Peppers today, or should they, I do some Sublime? I, I, I like the playlist. They, just, they play Sublime too much. No, I like the Sublime. Too much, though. It's good. Oh, no, Sublime. It's not enough song. I want to hear Eben. I don't just want Sub to hear David. Sublime needs to be heard by many more people. Yeah. They never got their proper due. Well, they have now that he overdosed. That's how how many songs are you playing by Sublime? I, we heard Date Rape this morning. I think there's like five in the library. That's okay. not bad. How many Aussie songs? You know, I don't know. Okay. I would like an answer. And by the way, that's not what I'm just spending my days doing. It's trying to find other air personalities. So we have some other people on the air. Screaming at me. What? What happened? Nothing. He's pointing up. I no, I wasn't. Where. I was pointing to this because you whapped yeah, it. Yeah, I know. I whapped it. Bang. All right, Bob. Are you done with her or what? Yeah. Well, first yeah, are you of all, done abusing me. I, I haven't abused you. Yeah, why don't you I hope you know nice. that. How about I've a actually, hug or something? I haven't abused you at all. I hope you know that. I've actually just. How about a hug? I've just explained, and my fantasy wasn't, uh, uh, you know, it wasn't like I was holding you down and pulling your hair and making you say. Yeah, that you know, would have been interesting, at least. Well. Oh. <laughs> Actually, if, uh -huh. if you got what I was trying to say, I was actually saying that. <laughs> That's exactly what I wanted to do, but apparently you didn't get the uh, the joke. No, uh, oh, we lost Anthony. He must have made it to the hospital there. But yeah, I, I mean, she's just amazing. She really is. All right, what about a hug or something? We got to end this so with something nice. I, I don't. Make her touch. Yeah, oh, is that skeeving you out? See, this yeah, is the thing. Is this, see, this is where you suck, Opie. No, because, I don't suck. Hang on one second. I'll tell you why. Because we, she actually would actually give me a little, little little flirt here and there, the smallest amount that would actually do me for like the weeks that I probably don't see her. Yeah. But now she's like treating me like that fucking hunk of shit. In other words, I played accurately. correctly. Thank exactly. you. Thank you, Jimmy. Good job. Good job. Exactly. His, job isn't, his job isn't to uh, help you enjoy right. yourself. His Give job is to entertain your America no, by right. shitting on your face. Treating... <laughs> <laughs> you fucking redheaded asshole. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I him with his wait, wait, wait. Rock. Oh, Jane says. Nice choice. Very good. We like Tracy. Uh, Nothing wrong with James much, as, as in, in the, uh, Tracy, I'm going to admit she, she's something. Amazing. I hate women in radio, and we've we've talked about it for many many years. And you got the big eyes, and you got shocked. But I'm going to say something nice. We respect you, and we like working uh, with you so far. Thank you. I like working because with you people guys. have asked. Because like, dude, you 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 guys had <laughs> awful things to say about women in radio all these years. I'm like, yeah, she's got a little edge to her, and she's uh, she's she's doing good so far. I'm she's not doing really good. like she's, other women in no, radio. No, well, either. duh. <laughs> she's not bad to look at either. Well, well, a, that wasn't why I was hired. Believe it or not, she's, she's actually better than a poke in the eye. <laughs> That's you're you're saying she was hired for her tits? Yeah, what are you What's saying? Why would they hire somebody? Because the fact that, it, like, at the virus shows, you have women walking around with no clothes on. Nobody's even talking to them. Right. Like the strippers at the virus show. Yeah, like, I know. Excuse me, I'm trying to get a glass of water. Could you get your tits out of my way? Like, nobody cares. <laughs> I ignore those. Don't why give a key show? position to a woman for her tits when they're, the tits are, like, laying around like dirty socks? Right. Exactly. Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? No, I agree with you. Okay. I, I knew I knew she was the real deal because the first time she came in here, Bobby, was yes. a Wednesday, and yeah. she was going to flash us for Whip Him Out Wednesday. Oh, and, she's a, and she's our boss. That's pretty good. And What's Tom today? said, don't fucking do that. Why well, would Tom she, do that? Bob prevented her from flashing up. You know what? She, she suns her here. tits next to the BQE all day long. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. How much does it really matter? <laughs> let's, let's Google Everybody Earth. Everybody going to Queens. When are you laying out? Let's Google, three to five let's Google Earth and try to find you. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, How funny would that be? <laughs> oh, that'd be funny if we just all showed up with vans of freaking <laughs> pests. <laughs> stared at you. Thank you tried God the summer's almost over. <laughs> oh, right. and, and she got us the, uh, the stripper pole. Nice. So far, only guys have used it, which uh, yeah. is a problem, but we'll work on that. We have a penthouse chick coming in, I think. Who's gonna do uh, tomorrow it. or today. What happened? Can she sit on top of Maybe it? Maybe tomorrow. And Are then, you really going to have a girl in there? Finally, yeah. And she got the new WoW stickers made, and she got the uh, the pasties made. I don't know why we need 10,000 pasties, but she got them made. I didn't make 10,000. Yeah. I thought pasties on parade, you know, could be fun. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
<laughs> you should have done a car crash. <laughs> okay, terrific. Yeah. <laughs> All right, how about a hug? How about one little hey, hug? Just come over and give me a hug. An Let's innocent go. hug. He's got a girlfriend. Hey, can I go? Uh, yeah. Can I, can I go, too, to the bathroom? <laughs> <laughs> all right. A, a very, like a hip-hop hug, not a real one. Easy yeah. with your... Uh, all right. Wait, what's a hip-hop hug? Right, you're good looking. Yeah, that's where you shake hands and you put the hand, the shaking <laughs> oh. hand between the bodies. All right. She's, you have to keep some uh, contact. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, I, thought, I really yeah, do have a crush, but, you know, I mean, come on. Look at your, your <laughs> Let's sweaty. not get carried away, Trace, okay? <laughs> <laughs> all right. You got the blueberry out of your teeth, so this is good. Did I really? <laughs> yes. No, all right. I'm, 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 I'm approaching you now, Bob. Here she comes. Bob's <laughs> now he's stuffing more Here blueberries in between his teeth. There's that. Here they go. They're, Tracy. Their bodies are going to touch. Oh, look, look she's, his hand. she's showing him how. Ew, she doesn't oh, want anything to do with you. That was really oh, sad. Oh, Bob, how bad was that? Let's be honest. Oh. She didn't want anything to do with you. It's, it's, you're acting like it's the first time it's ever happened to me in my life. Uh, <laughs> you're like the elephant man with a burlap sack over Tracy. here. I am not an animal. There goes Tracy. Yeah. Bye, Tracy. Take care, sweetie. Goodbye. Oh, now you're smooth, all. Bob. Take not care. The, Take yeah. care, sweetie. Hey, baby good. doll. <laughs> hey, doll face. Good for you, huh? Hey, go, go get hey. yourself something. Yeah. So how did her appearance go? She was very badly raped. <laughs> <laughs> right, I guess we lost Ann. I think he's at a hospital right now. So, All right, why don't we take a break? I'm doing good with these buttons, I think. You're terrific. And if you knew the gasser, I just passed up. Oh, uh, God. I didn't know it. I didn't do it. Well, no, I'm in a fucking, uh, Dude, my this... lungs are processing something your right here. shit. My lungs are taking particles of your shit and dispersing them into my bloodstream, into my brain. So. Atta boy. You're welcome. Yep. All right. This she, station's uh, running fine. Hey, uh, this was made for you, Jimmy. On the next Opie and Anthony show, Opie and Anthony face their toughest challenge yet. Hey, this is uh, Jim Norton. Listen as one man describes an addiction. Wherever there were cocks, there was me. And how he went from one cock too many. I was taking a hundred a night. What do you think of them apples? Then you'll hear a horrifying <laughs> tale of a bukkake party gone wrong. Blurka, 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 blurka. <laughs> All over my fat, colorless stomach. I can't tell where the cum ends and my skin begins. <laughs> blurka, blurka, blurka. Plus, an ending you won't want to miss. That's right. I say a couple of men do some docking and settle this. It all happens on the next Opie and Anthony show. Man, that's not bad, man. Who did that, Derek? <laughs> Dirk did that. That's a good job right there. That's pretty good stuff. <laughs> All right. I would got, watch that movie. We got Louis C.K. We got Bob Kelly. We got uh, Jimmy. Nothing. <laughs> Ooh. I like you on the buttons. You finally used it correctly. I'm enjoying the buttons. Um, All right. We'll uh, regroup. You we'll look continue. like a button. It's open. Do I? <laughs> I just... How about a little variety? Greg Hughes and Anthony Cumia have announced. We hate women and we butt sex each other. No, we shan't be doing that. One of you guys can eat my ass right now. It's fantastic. <laughs> uh, it's Opie and Anthony. Anthony, of course, uh, went home early today, but he did a fine job from his car for a while. He's Bob Kelly in studio. From the hospital. Yeah, Jim Norton in studio. Louis C.K. in studio. And uh, there was something, I can't remember. There was something with Bobby that I was thinking about in the bathroom. Oh, your sick contest you want to do. Well, the... Uh, Why don't you explain? Because uh, I'm going to sound like an ass if I do it. What, the the uh, baby wipe? Yeah, he wants to do a baby wipe uh, contest. What What's is that? that? Well, that's where every you get a thing of baby wipes, and then you just randomly, everybody picks one, and you have to take one swipe of your uh, ass... And uh, see who has the uh, cleanest or dirtier what, ass. Why the fuck do you want to? <laughs> I actually like that. How about let's go to a ball game and hang around or something? I don't want to do it for an afternoon. Drink after some beer. Louis, I don't want to do it for an afternoon. I want to oh. just take one swipe and see what happens. <laughs> what, are you, what are you? Oh, in that case, everything in moderation, Bob. <laughs> it sounds awesome. And then, and then you're, acting like, you're acting like the show doesn't fucking do that every day. I don't want to scrutinize and, a baby wipe that you just fucking rubbed on your asshole. And then what oh, happens? Apparently, he's not and confident in his just asshole. Hair. And then what? <laughs> hey, but then what happens? Do we just laugh at the person that has the messiest ass? Well, like, how does it play out? No, in your actually, mind? the person with the. Uh, 
you could go two ways. Whether the person with the dirtiest ass <laughs> could win, but it wouldn't be us. It would be like you know when you bring the guys in to play uh, those that like what the hell is that? Right, right. You could have them do it because you know we. Oh, well, yeah, it have no, to be people that better. the listeners know really well. And Jimmy can't be in the contest because he has oh. to clean his ass. So I know where you're getting at. What? I know. Don't. <laughs> what? Go. Oh, that's all right. Show all right. me how you suck a guy's cock. All right. The last on. time I'm going to ask you. Where, where am I going with this, Bobby? <laughs> huh? You try? You you want to play now? I, I don't know. Me uh, and you? Go head to head? I, uh, I'll play right now. My yeah. asshole fucking squeaks. You can I eat lima beans. I said that already. already. Really? I know. Yeah, he's, he, Jimmy's not going to... Uh, Jimmy's going to come out clean. I'll all the time? Why all the time? Because I'm a fucking clean guy. I have a, I have a hairless asshole, which girls love to sniff and lick. Bobby, why don't you start the contest off? <laughs> no, you're out of your mind. Go get some why fucking... Don't you're why, you're why, a, why don't you yeah, start the contest? You really need to work on it. You know, weird. you used to be so good at that. Now you just like... <laughs> right. Now you start singing and you're giggling. And you don't want to, You kind of look away. Bobby, you're really weird, <laughs> He's dude. figured out my poker face. I hate uh, you for that. Get I'm some... Really, uh, no, it's funny because he suggests it. He goes, <laughs> right. how about if we rub uh, wi baby wipes on our assholes and show them to each other? But don't, hey, don't make me do it. Yeah. Bobby, why don't you start don't, the contest? you're not going to get... All right, I'll hey, do it. if we all jerk off, it's fun. If all right. I just jerk no. off, it's weird. I understand, yeah. Bobby. <laughs> Bob <laughs> raises a good point. I do. I, I Bobby, raise a good point. What? Bobby, if you do it, I uh, I will do it. Uh, you know, you know, I have a tattoo. Actually, a friend of mine said that too, and he never got one. So go mm, fuck I, yourself. I, yeah. <laughs> all right. Like How's that sound? Don't get pissed. You got you a tattoo. Don't, don't use my needy and my but, fucking but want, get, wanting to belong against me. But don't get pissed at me. <laughs> you right. suggested this. But I I didn't suggest it for us. I suggested it. You know, you could do. No, no, no. No, the, the begin, first time you told begin, me it was for us. Yes, the, this all began with you Thank saying you. You weren't we, even all, here. we all. Yeah, I'm sitting here watching it come out of your face. The wet those words. <laughs> we all put baby wipes on no, our, because, our assholes. No, and then you started them. to feel weird, oh. and you changed it to the people that come in. Uh, well, uh, actually, Opie, uh, the original plan was for other people, but Opie used his mind skills. And uh, no, Adam you said it though. Yeah, you, because you I didn't want to say it. Yeah. Bobby, oh, good guys, let's do some asshole wiping. All right, Bobby, Bob. start the contest. I'm not doing that. And everyone's look. Why look. are you doing it? What? Why? I don't I, I don't need a reason not don't to wipe like my asshole and your... show you what was on it. <laughs> yes, you do. All the guys are doing it, Lou. Uh, yeah, yeah, well, let's go to. Uh, hold on, Jake right, and yeah. Buffalo. Go, Jake. Try to get yeah, in we, here. Yeah. yeah, we can play spots on whose ass is the dirtiest or the cleanest. Well, they're already betting on pal talk and some feedback. See, Bobby, you might be onto something. Yeah. All right. Oh, are you in? Yeah, if you do it on that. <laughs> there you go. Wait a minute. You got to no, We all have to view it. You can't just wipe your fucking. I'm not viewing Jimmy oh, dude, fucking wiping I, his ass. I, I saw him do it. You just yeah. got to make sure. I do. Do it, please. Get look. <laughs> I don't want to. <laughs> you don't need to ask twice with yeah. Jimmy. Twice with the same paper. Look at that. Oh, God. Look at that. Look at that. There you go. There you go. There you go. Ah, Jesus. There we go. Here we go. Oh, Twice oh. with the same paper. All right, Bobby's And I wiping. dug it in there. Bobby's wiping his ass. How deep did you get it? Did you go inside with no, the No, I finger? just rubbed it. I, I'll, I'll go with the finger. Oh, hang on. It's caught in my fat ass. Hang on. <laughs> oh, I'm actually He's going to pull out an he's umbrella. He's so happy. He looks so happy. This is what he wanted Wait, to happen, and it's happening. Oh, he's pulling oh, out God. a hair. I pulled out one of my girlfriend's hairs. So. Oh, Okay. Well, you're hoping it's a girlfriend's hair. Uh, is it clean? Uh, pretty clean, man. There you it's go. Pretty good. Uh, Wonderful. Lou? Pretty good. Good for you. Yeah, enjoy yourselves. Yeah. All right. How awkward do you feel now? I'm I not know. doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I feel, if I did it by myself, I'd feel awkward. But if little Jimmy, me and him play a yeah, little Jimmy, game. Jimmy, oh, dude, he's, he's throwing it at Craig. <laughs> I just missed Craig's head. But it was uh, clean, though. I dug it right in my crack. Yeah. I love that. Wow, that was a fun game. Hey, Bob, that was a great game. Uh, well, who did? Who won? I killed two minutes. No, well, I'd say if you get a few people in here that maybe have a dirty ass, it's you have a dirty fun. ass. I think Lou's ass right now. I, oh, it's fucking. It like, looks like fucking a Katrina. He, yeah, he hasn't showered since oh. his last show. <laughs> Dude, I got butterscotch pudding once again today. I'm not doing it. You, oh, oh come on, just do it. It's leaking out. Just test it. I would it. love that. Test no. it. I want to see your too much too much wasabi with my sushi. I How think about Iraq? 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 What do you say, E? What do you say? Come on. Just clean. You probably pull out this a oh, load on it. You tried it already? Adult wipes. Get yeah. some homemade mustard on that wet nap. Right, we, <laughs> I would have too much homeless guy dick blood on my. Oh, I hear you. I hate that. Yeah. Are we gonna do? Kind uh, of come on, Ope. wipe one down. Let's see what you got. It's come on. Just do it. I'm, I'm doing an extreme uh, male camel toe tomorrow. Don't worry. I'm I, bringing in my swipe. Oh, just swip it That's down. That's my thing. I'll do that tomorrow. Give it take, a swipe. Just take a swipe on, and let's, let's see, see the, what you got down Steve, there. Be a the, man. Get Steve or uh, Danny. Do it for you. Someone else had. I want. I want E Rock to do it. Someone else has to do it. E Rock's doing it. Here you go. 
He wrote you got is, is this used, this one? No. <laughs> no I don't Are you sure? It. I threw it out. Relax. That's going to reuse them. You can't reuse them. All right, there's... going to have a shit shroud of torrin on his... Uh... <laughs> all right, wait. <laughs> but you got to get it nice. you got to get from the taint all the way up to the ass crack. Why don't you, like, uh, assist? Go do it for him, Bobby. I, I want, want to help him Hey, out look, there. I, I made the game. I, you know, I want, I want it to be done correctly. Rub it in there. Right. Get it in there, sweetie. That plump little buttocks. It's cold. Yeah, it's oh, I know it's cold. Get your finger... Actually, stick your finger in there a little bit. Come on, stick your finger in. It's, somebody wrote it's wipe it out when they got. <laughs> What's the, there's some hair, but it's uh, oh, it's clean. clean. We're a fucking very hygienic show, yeah, Fan. Very good. Fan, what do you got in there? All kinds of stuff. Is it bad? No. You get a dirty crack? Oh. What do you have? What do you got? What do you get? Someone's gonna wipe their crack. What the fuck? Crack. Come on. Craig, why don't you wipe your crack? Craig, uh, wipe your crack. Craig Let's... is the uh, the star of the uh, dodgeball video. Most likely, it's gonna it is gonna be dirty. Oh, just really? Deal with that's the joke. No one wants to be a clean assholes. The clean assholes are boring. <laughs> it's gonna look like you just ate chocolate chip cookies. <laughs> it's gonna be like dog food and. A... <laughs> All right, he's uh, like, he's getting in there. Uh, he's too. getting in there. He's actually. Wow. Oh, this kid ain't shot. He's squatting. He's nice. squatting like I tell my daughter to when I have to wipe her oh, in, a, in a parking lot. That's he, clean. He, oh, Bob, this is a terrific bit. Well, I'm yeah, sorry that know. nobody has oh, a dirty six. asshole for you. Oh, oh for six. I'm I say, you. oh, you should, you should give oh, it away. Oh, you got a nice hot mustard sandwich down there. <laughs> and I say you should take it out. It's bad. I'm not. Get your goddamn, <laughs> get your Frenchie's mustard right on that napkin. Just the one you want to be a cool, refreshing And wipe. your ass will be clean. Everybody know you got a clean if, ass. If, uh, if Lou does it, I'll do it. All right, Lou. I'm not doing it. <laughs> oh, well. Lou's going to go. Is your ass really dirty? Yeah. No, I, well, I mean, it might be. I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't is. matter. He's I mean, I, look, if you, if you want to say my asshole's dirty, go I ahead. I think Lou... Okay, your asshole's dirty. Okay, there you go. That. Enjoy that. Little fucking tricks aren't going to work. I actually took a shit in my pants just now. <laughs> Louie wants to be legit. He doesn't want a story coming out that he was wiping his Oh, I don't look. Are you out of your mind? Have you seen any of the videos on yeah. his website? Yeah, we were playing yeah, them yesterday. He's talking about it. His videos, first of all, are going to be some of the funniest fucking videos ever. Start saying that I'm gay right now. <laughs> Who says anything? But uh, I just don't feel like putting my hand with a wipey in right, my we, asshole and showing it to. All right, we got Kelly. somebody else. Oh, you know, oh this Danny, is, this yeah. could be really oh, ugly. God. Man. Oh, it's funny. Hey, you know, he just ate hot wings and drank a yeah. ton of beer last uh, night. There's gonna be a tequila worm on yeah. it. He's gonna have five different color hairs on it. All right, Danny, what do you think? Well, my my gas has haven't been pretty this morning. What? So it might be a little. Uh... Does it look like uh, like baby food yeah, carrots? It's so wet. <laughs> <laughs> I know mine's bad because it's been kind of itchy all uh, morning. Okay. <laughs> Yours, you uh, you got to be careful though. Sometimes it's not shit. Sometimes it's just that oily yeah, uh, that prostate of, fluid that seeps out. A little tahini sauce. Right, right. Where do I need? I gotta go in the bathroom. <laughs> well, everyone's been. Hummus. Whatever you want to do, Danny. Yeah, we're gonna make sure. Happy. Yeah, everyone else has just been kind of like sneaking a swipe while yeah. mm -hmm. while everyone kind of talking in there. You get, in. get your two fingers. There's, there's rules to this. You gotta get your two fingers, wrap it around there, and take a nice swipe oh, up the God. top. Let's all wipe our assholes and show it. The fuck is wrong <laughs> with you? I, you know what? <laughs> oh, you're you're what they the call a, bring you a party pooper. No yes. pun intended. Yes. Oh, exactly. <laughs> Party pooper. Oh, look at you. I love Did you get in there, though? Yeah, no, I'm Get exactly. down. At, you gotta, no, Danny's going to do the right thing. you got to bend down to open it up. Right. Ooh, Danny will do the right thing. He's you know. Now swipe it. Right. <laughs> He's the real deal. All right. All right. Did it get stuck? I got a little something. Oh, oh God. What are you... Oh, yeah, I got a little something. <laughs> and now Bob's going to throw up. Come here, Bobby. Why did... This is what Bobby, he... Bobby, go show him. He show wanted him, yeah. to go throw show up. Show show him. Him. What's go wrong show with him. this Bobby, guy? Bobby, come over here. Uh, Danny just wants to show you. Danny just... <laughs> he's throwing... He's going to throw up now. Yeah. He's throwing up. He's oh fucking God. vomiting. Why do you vomit so easily? But, but sir, you brought the whole thing on yourself, you fucking freak. Take a look at it. Take a look at it. It. Bobby, smell it. Like you want it. What does it look like, Bobby? <laughs> Jesus Christ. What's wrong with this guy? Look, it's a new game. I didn't know it was going to make You me made it up. Dude, you yes, made you up the did. Game. You wanted this to happen. Bobby, You're just like, smell it. Just smell it. Just smell the paper. Just smell it. You out of your fucking mind. Just, I'll give you a bucket. Out of your mind. You, he did exactly smell what you told him to do. Smell it. Oh, okay. Fuck Bobby. Yourself. Bobby, what does it look like? What does it look like? Everyone in radio. Eight. Well, yeah, just describe it. He's got, um... Hang on one second. It looks like he, uh... Please throw that away. Jesus he ate Christ. Christ. Just show him. Hold on, Dan. I'm describing. He can't remember. <laughs> Jesus like? Christ. Let's, let's let me go. I got a better look at it. It's, uh... No, take on. a look and then Keep describe it. Keep it right now. Oh, my God. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> take it. Yeah, it's very nasty. Oh, God. It looks it's like, like, uh... 
He ate a, like a hot fudge sundae or something. It's a little... <laughs> Bob, you need fucking help. It looks like someone took a baby wipe and then tried to pick up a Hershey Kiss with it. Oh, that's sweet. Aww. Bobby, there you go. There's your Bobby, contest. Bobby, five bucks if you put it on your head. Sure Five bucks to put on your head. I didn't know that was... Ugh. No, you didn't know. Because you told him for a half an hour how to take two fingers and make sure he gets every bit of it. Yeah, yeah. And then you're amazed that there's a little bit of shit on it to right, make you Dad. puke. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I bet you if suck. Louis swiped, it would look like a paintball accident. <laughs> uh, we, got, we got a call from Canada. You know what that means. Oh, no. What? Uh, Steve, what's up? Hey, how's it going, guys? Hey. hey, your country doesn't matter. Steve, Toronto. <laughs> yeah. Damn it. Uh, I'm thinking this is Bob Kelly's way of losing some weight. Why don't you go eat a decroted piece of crap? Canada never disappoints. Yep. It, it has been pointed out on some of the fan sites that Canada calls suck. Yep. Canada's a... But thanks for standing on guard for thee. Whatever I the think. fuck that means. Oh, that's all right, but you gave it a shot. Thank you for not mattering above us. <laughs> <laughs> we don't even pay attention. No. <laughs> There's a million easy ways to get into this country. Whatever, oh, dude. God. Have fun. All right. Uh, I, I got the latest news coming in here. Hmm. We got some things happening in the world. Uh, nature's fury. A heat wave blamed in nearly a dozen deaths continues to bake large parts of the south. People are dying from the heat in the south. Yep. I was just in Phoenix. It was 115 degrees. And you were jogging. Yeah, I was jogging. Yeah. It felt good. But all those people Imagine if you wiped his ass after a 115-degree yeah. uh, uh, jog there, Bobby. It would have smelled nice. Yeah, it smelled like snake shit. It'd be fantastic. Are, are you coming back to life? Yeah, yeah. No, I was just thinking of something. What? Huh? Another contest? No, I mean, look, I'm just trying to add to the show. Oh, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> It is. A, it's a weird, you could do it's a, a weird form of bulimia. Like you, you try to get yourself to a place where you like this weird kind of sexual humiliation and then vomiting because of some guy's shit. That's how Bob feels it's about so himself. Weird. Well, it's actually, and then you regret it immediately. It's a weird cycle. It's really interesting to watch well, that happen. I didn't. I didn't think I was going to puke. I've never really. You're you're assuming that shit just makes me puke. I don't see shit all the time, uh, Lou. Do you ever hold it in your mouth? Wow. You ever hold shit in your mouth? What the fuck? Hold was that? shit in your mouth like a cigar? Like just hold it there? No, like you're on your back and they drop a log in your mouth oh. and it stands up and then kind of tips over on the side of your face and you go, uh huh. Oh, God. Have you really done that? No, I didn't say I have. Oh, God. <laughs> exactly. I didn't say I have. And what are you going to say to him, Lou? Talk to him. Well, I, he knows what he wants. That's the thing. Like, he just goes to a woman and says, shit in my face and I'll hold it in my mouth for a second and then we'll watch it fall like a tree. He just does that, but you go, let's have this contest, and then you go, I don't want to do it. You pretend you don't want to do it for a minute, and then you really get into it, and then you get, then you see shit and you vomit. And he's rooting for a dirty asshole the whole time. He's yep. rooting. Rooting. Yeah, you were kind of disappointed, right? Because he even, was, and then even when he Danny's ass was relatively clean. Right. Well, not really. Can you little, imagine licking Danny's no, ass without that fucking no, white thing in that smell? Sh there was shit on the thing. That's no, not, I didn't, I didn't it's get not a good even look near then. clean. I didn't get a good look then. Oh, I saw, ours like, was I relatively did. clean because it was I a couple like, of hairs, saw, like, maybe a, a little a, ass oil. I saw like a light crayon. Like it was, thing. It was a brown smudge. Smart. Yeah. You know, uh, years ago when I got blown in a condemned building uh, on 23rd Street on a dirty mattress on the floor uh, by some woman with chunks out of her hair, um, and then her boyfriend tried to beat me up, and I ran away. Why? And then I'm standing outside, because the whole point was suck my dick, take my $10, and then mug me and take everything else. I don't know why she was oh, you, didn't bother to blow me. You almost were part of that scam. Yeah, it was really bad. See, But anyway, when I was standing outside and my dick felt weirdly gross from having been blown by this woman, I might be I might be dead in the ear from what I just caught. I almost just died, and I'm covered with sweat. I realized I was after this feeling right here. Like, all every decision I made was just me wanting to feel this fucked up. Wait, did you and did you wrong come? wrong and what? Did you come? Yeah. Now, how did you know the boyfriend to beat you up? Because she said like get him or something like like I, I came out of the room and he was standing there and she said, "They get him quick before he and I ran away and I had to run away from both of them." How slow were they? I got out of the building. You yeah, just they, came. They, were, they were dumb. Yeah, they were dumb. Yeah, shouldn't you have had wobbly legs still? Yeah. No, I go. I was he big? He was uh, scrawny but not, you know, nothing to lose kind of dangerous, you know. Gross people. But anyway, Jesus. what I'm saying is, wait, what was this? this is what Bob oh. does with his? Hold life. on, what was the he turn? gets himself in these situations wait, 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 where wait, he wait, feels wait. bad? But Louis, what was the turn on there? 
Uh, I so just, she was a mess. Yes, yeah, and you were in a, a really like awful like. Yeah. It was a bad bad scene. Yeah, I'm yeah. just I'm just yeah. wiping my but ass. <laughs> you, you're just, fucking an AIDS whore in a fucking condemned building. She has patches of hair missing, yeah, and so and her boyfriend's watching you, fucking faggot. How the fuck am I? <laughs> no, he wasn't there while I was being blown. <laughs> Jesus Christ! What was threw up after somebody showed you their shit that you uh, begged just, them to show you? Well, I, I, uh, the, I didn't I didn't know I was gonna puke in a on contest. Shit. I really don't know what's gonna make men. me puke. That's what the thing Dude, is. You you, you puke at everything. Ah, just shit. We haven't makes me puke. we haven't given you one thing. That you don't know what you you don't know what makes you puke except for shit makes you puke. Shit and you beg the guy to wipe his asshole and show Let's you. Let's not get carried away. I'm not a fucking audience <laughs> member, Lou. Like you asshole. <laughs> I fucking didn't beg him. I wasn't going to blow. I'm not trying to make you feel bad. Begged. I'm just fascinated. Kind of begged. All right, maybe I did. You've been you've, yeah. you've is, brought up this idea. Like people don't know this. You have you've brought this idea up with me a few times off air. <laughs> <laughs> Bob's getting a little upset, Bob. Well, I'm sorry. Are you upset? I don't mean to upset you, Bob. It's fascinating to me. Yeah. Not really? Yeah, okay, good. <laughs> it is. All right. I want to one of my favorite. Favorite guys, Bob. I love you. I love you too. Love yeah, you too nothing really. above you. Wait, wait, I once had a rusty <laughs> squat off my chest, and I told her you didn't use suppositories, and she said no. And she went to shit, and a fucking suppository bounced off my chest, and then <laughs> a fucking a pile of wet meatloaf fell onto my stomach, and it reeked. Oh. It reeked of fucking like ethnic food. <laughs> You've like never it. seen life until you've seen a fucking a suppository bounce off your own chest. <laughs> a pile like, of digested couscous. It, it looked like a lamb. It looked like it was, pot roast. I don't know what it was. It had chest. a dude, awful, like a sour, uh, uh, a foreign food stench to it. <laughs> it was horrendous. Oh, God. She had some Ethiopian elk. Just a wet pile on my yeah. stomach, and I'm like, what happened when I was younger <laughs> that caused this to be the way I jerk off? <laughs> what are you jerking off? What, what else am I supposed to do? <laughs> Fucking read and miss the whole thing? <laughs> I just don't know. I'm a fighter. There's, there's, there's no. Pardon my me. French. I'm going to open this hole like this. Bob, are you, do you want uh, anyone else to wipe their asses? You know, no, I'm good. Right with that? I'm good. I'm good, Ope. Thank you. All right. I'm good. And that's my last idea I give you. <laughs> hey, you gave me something. It would have been great if that scene. You, you, know, you turned everything against me, you <laughs> son of a bitch. It would have been great if that scene. You never wants a team player. Hey, this is a good idea. Hey, Bob, no one you wants to hear ass. team player. That's true. They really don't, that's Bob. That's true. All right. All right. At about 1.30 in the morning on April 12, William Lewis walked down the hall at Texas Women's <laughs> Hospital. That white bundle in his hands, his four-day-old baby girl. Oh. Several minutes later, a Houston police officer shot Lewis with a taser, and the baby, Carla, crashed to the floor. Okay. Officer Crash. David Bowling <laughs> and the sheriff's deputy claim they thought Lewis was kidnapping his baby. Lewis contends he and his wife just wanted to leave the hospital and simply did not follow hospital rules. So the guy uh, got tased. He got he's... tased for walk, uh, <laughs> going, uh, leaving the hospital with his baby without a wristband or something. Yeah, they, well, they don't know. I mean, they try to talk to the guy. There's a history with this guy of domestic violence. With his woman, so there might How do have they know? What, do they look him up before they fucking oh, I don't tase know. him? I don't know. That might just be stuff I found out after, but the guy was being a He douche. got a baseball card for his wife beating? <laughs> but wait. <laughs> look at his stats. Let's yes. tase this We, we need more on the story, because it gets to the point where they're tasing him as he's leaving the hospital with That's a, crazy. A, a four-day old? What happens Does anyone this, <coughs> The babies have little bracelets. It's really genius, so you can't steal yeah, but babies. They, but did they, did, did they tell him... Put the baby down or put the baby back. And I think he kept they walking. did. I don't know. They were trying to talk to him. He wasn't being cooperative. But they didn't just go yes or hit four and then zap somebody him. who's fucking uh, holding, holding a, baby? a baby. I agree, but he's a big guy. It doesn't seem right when she says the baby crashed to the. It's a baby. It's not a you know crashed to the floor like a bunch of tin cans and a. Yeah, it's a little baby. Mm. The 22-year veteran officer appears to arrive at the incident holding his taser. Under, the, under this circumstance, when you know you've already got a, an issue up there, you've already got a, a large male suspect who's already agitated and already threatening, uh, you'd already come up with your taser. After a couple of minutes of talking, Lewis Bowling shoots his taser. When the Houston father went down, the baby did as well. Lewis claims the newborn fell on her head and suffered severe injuries. After the fall, officers handed the baby to her stunned mother. She has since spoken out against the officer and defended her husband. Wow. I've got to wonder what kind of a moron would tase an adult holding a baby, said George Kirkham, a former police officer and criminologist at the University of California, Berkeley. It doesn't take rocket science to realize the baby's going to fall. Yeah, man. You're yeah, not going to hold on to the ball. Yeah. Uh, hold on to the ball. Hold on to the baby. <laughs> when the guy's tased. The guy's dying to use that taser. 
The elevators would not move because wristband <laughs> sensors on each baby shut off the elevators if anyone takes an infant without yeah, permission. Yeah, you can't get out. How come the father wasn't wearing a, a wristband? I don't know, but because uh, they always give the father a wristband. Yeah. Well, there you go. That that's terrible. I'm sorry. Ooh, perfect, Jimmy. Perfect. I still have my wristbands from when my daughters were born, so I can go steal babies. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> fuck them and eat them. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, they don't turn it off. <laughs> I could have two for lunch. Oh, <laughs> uh, wait, here's uh, this guy. Brooklyn Ace knows a little more. Brooklyn Ace, what's up? Yeah, I have a feeling I have the same article in front of me as you do, Opie, because I'm, I sent it in to Steve. Um, the part that I found amusing was Child Protective Services has custody of baby because of a history of domestic violence between Lewis and his wife, Jacqueline Gray. Um, first of all, why does she have a different last name? Sounds like there's a huge well, issue here. But it, it, it's like... What? Right. Now you raise a good point. No, it's not. My wife and I have different names. No, nah, but he's raised this guy's right, though. <laughs> Why would you All right. a guy with All right, Brooklyn Ace. Ridiculous. Later, guys. Uh, nice. All right. Hey, uh, K-Rock's doing something because their phone's just exploded. <laughs> Let's see what they're doing. Can we answer their phones? Oh, come on. How do I get over here? Hey, K Rock. Hey. Hey, what's up? Why are you calling? Uh, win the concert tickets. Yeah, what concert tickets? Oh, shit. What well, concert you tickets? You can't curse, you're on the radio. Yeah, what, what tickets are you calling for? <laughs> uh, is this the Velvet Revolver one? Ah, uh, yes, for the Velvet Revolver tickets. That's right, sir. What caller uh, do you need to be? <laughs> yeah. uh, this is Heath from Long Island. I didn't ask your name. I don't give a shit. They don't pay me enough to know you. And what's the magic phrase that pays? <clears throat> <laughs> hurry, hurry. we got to move on. on. How do you get your tickets? Hmm? All right, next. K-Rock. Hey, am I calling 92? You, uh, you are calling are... for what? Calling for the Velvet Revolver tickets. <laughs> and, and what did we tell you to say? What's that? What's the magic phrase? Yeah, you have to say something to get the tickets. <laughs> Hurry, hurry, come on, let's go, let's go. Oh, I don't remember. I, I might go in 92. You call in 92, you won the tickets as long as you say... Shit in the mouth of Christ. <laughs> <laughs> K-Rock. Hey, you're right there. Hey, what's up? How are you, sir? Why are you calling us today? I'm trying to win some tickets. That's right, what tickets? All right, I'm hoping Project Revolution. Asshole! Project Revolution. And what caller do you have to be? Number nine. Yeah, you're number eight. I'm sorry, <laughs> sir. <laughs> hello. 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 Yeah, hello. Hello. Hello, yeah. Did I win? Hello. Is the hello. caller there? Hello. Yes. Hello, yes. Hello. You're on the air. You're on the air. Hello. What's your name? Yeah. Yeah, Mike. Mike Tosilov. Hello. Hello. Yes. Hello. All right. Cool. Hello. So, uh, what what caller are you? The phrase that pays, right? What? Yes. What caller are you? I'm I'm calling number ninety three. What uh, tickets you looking for? You're you're right. You're calling ninety three, but we're looking for caller ninety two. Thanks Sorry. for calling. Sorry, sir. Hello. Did I win? Uh That um, depends. Oh, uh, he's one of ours. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Hello? I'm calling 92. Hey. Hello. How you doing? Hello. Okay. Hello. 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 Hi. Hello. The caller's there. Hey, what's Hello. going on? How are you? Hello? Hello. Hi, this is Lenny. How are you? Okay. How are you? I'm great. Am I calling number 92? Am I calling number 92? I don't know. Somebody said this is calling 92. What's going on? <laughs> oh, God. I don't know. So who Do I call a 92? <laughs> Who's this? My name's Pat. No. Hello? 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 
Hello, is the caller there? Yes, yes the call I'm is here. here. What's going on? Oh, hold on one second. Hello, the call is here. Hello. Hello, is the caller there? Yes, I'm here, man. What's going on? Hello? Oh, uh, hello. Uh, is the caller there? Yes, it's here, Lenny. It's... What's up, man? Where's the female? Hello, is the caller there? Hello. Hello. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um. Is the guy there? Yes, the hello? guy is here. What's up, boy? What caller are you? Is the girl there? Ninety-two. Is the girl there? Yes, yes, yes. Is the hello? guy there? Yeah, I'm here. Guy there? Can't hear him. Yes. Girl there? Yes. You ready to go on the air? Man. You ready to go on the air right now? Yes. All right. Uh, get ready. Here we go. <clears throat> Time for the prize patrol. Hello? Hello? 92.3 K-Rock, who do we have on the line? Lenny, what's going on, man? How are you? Is the girl there? Yes. Is the guy there? Oh. Yeah, man. Girl? Hello? Show me how you suck a guy's cock. The last time I'm going to ask you. <laughs> this is great. Come on, man. Who's, who's going to get him? you got to fight it out. Will it be the girl or the guy? Come on, man. Come on. I'm at work, man. I can't. Let's go. Where are you? I'll come down and get the tickets right now. All right. Uh, how about this? Insult contest. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Insult contest? Yeah. What do you got to say to the broad? What do I got to say? I don't know. You said info. What kind of info do you want? I'll give you some answers. Liar, whore. Liar, whore. You know it. Is the girl there? Yeah. <laughs> what do you have to say for yourself? What? Well, at least this is fun. This is better than uh, something. At least I got a shot. Come on. Uh, why don't you guys insult each other, and whoever does a better job will uh, get the tickets. There you go. There you go. Are you serious? Yes, go uh, ahead. Well, why the hell should she get him since I was the first caller in 92? Boo. That wasn't that good. All uh, right, girl? No, it wasn't. I don't know. Girl, come back. Let's go. What do you got for him? Hello? Yeah. Uh, insult right, the guy in the line. Insult she's the she's other she's guy, she's and you win the tickets. I don't know where she's at, man. Come on. This girl doesn't even know. She probably doesn't. She's not even in the city, doesn't sound like. She's got some accent from, like, Long Island or some hick-ass accent. Come on, Ooh. man. What do you got to say about that, lady? Look, she doesn't what? even know the planet about, she's about what? She's not what? attention. What? Miss, you got to. Come on. We're having an insult oh, contest. Oh, Hey, Hello? you got to insult the guy. Yeah, we're having an insult contest. He's beating you up. What do you have to say to the guy that's on the phone with you? Hello? Hey. There's nothing to say. Come on. She doesn't even know where she's at. You guys got to give it up. Hey, Rock, Rock. Say, please. Hey, girl. Yes? You have to insult the other guy, and if you say something mean, you win, twat. <laughs> you win oh the contest God. and the tickets. Yes. You're on the air right now, you She's fucking retard. No, come You're on. You're on the not fucking on the radio, you fucking air? stupid cunt. She's a fucking retard. Sorry, I'm ruining it. <laughs> they still think they're on the radio. Doing? You're on the radio, miss. You have to insult the guy, and you're not insulting him. You're just being the silly hole that you've always been. <laughs> Who, whoever does the best insult, you two shitheads, wins. That's right. Wipe your ass with a baby wipe and hold it up. If it's got a log on it, you win fucking tickets, and Slash will shit in your mouth. <laughs> Come on. Uh, Come on, you guys. We're telling you, what do you want to hear? That's right. I, 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 uh, Guess the phrase that pays and Ted Nugent will kick you in the cunt. <laughs> Come on, K Rock Rock. Come on. I'm That's not the phrase that pays you, fucking, you silly, yeah. titless nothing. Hey, what's, what's the girl's name? We got an idea from Nate Sack. Uh, girl's name, what's your name? Pat. Hey, hey, Pat, can you repeat after me? Okay. I suck cock for K Rock. I suck twat for K Rock? No, I suck cock for K Rock. You hear perfectly except for the word cock. <laughs> dumb reach. What? <laughs> you can't put that on the radio. Yes, no. you can. We're going to beep it. We it's are okay. on the radio. Yeah, well, we're trying to be a little edgier with the, the, you know, the station, so we'll That's bleep right. that part. So after me, I suck cock for K Rock. I suck what for K Rock? Again. Perfect uh, pitch on. hearing, Hear except me. for the thing that's constantly in her mouth. I'm I'm a professional DJ. Repeat after me. Are you ready? Okay, okay. All right, here we go. I suck cock for K Rock. I suck cock for K Rock. <laughs> wow. You're wow. bad. You're now, bad. Now, sir, it's your My turn. All right, hold on. Now, hold on. Let's okay. let the other guy get an opportunity. Now the guy has to say it. What's your guy? What's what's your name, sir? You talking to me now, fine? Yeah. Yeah. What's your yeah. name? 
<laughs> my name is Lenny, man. Do you have a sucker guy's cock? I'm getting some laughs out of you guys. I'm not getting some tickets, obviously, but at least this is entertaining. Well, Lenny, why don't we do this? Why don't you repeat after me, okay? <clears throat> I suck cock for k Rack. I refuse to say that, man. Hell no. Cause you I don't want the tickets, then. I want I them. I want that. them. Hold on, you silly hole. We're talking to Lenny. <laughs> We're get, Pat's going to get the tickets unless you say the phrase, Lenny. I'm not saying that phrase. I'll say we've got, the phrases at that. I don't go that all right, way. How about, we've got tickets. We've got backstage passes. We also yeah. got a limo to and from the show. And your mother's cunt in a box. <laughs> Yeah. Exactly, boss. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. And then we're going to fuck you with a broomstick. Or a broom. Or if we have a broom, we'll use that. <laughs> the fuck is that? B-R-U-M? Uh, we we need a broom. <laughs> Alright, we obviously got a... We obviously got a problem here. We got two winners on the line. We can only give it to one. Alright, let's give these. How about we have a uh, masturbation contest? First right. person to come wins the tickets. What do you say, guys? Come on, I, I said what you wanted me to say. I should win. <laughs> she feels dirty now. Yeah, she does. Do you feel a little dirty? I hope some of this makes it on the radio at least. This is not bad. All right, whoever. My, my husband and my son would kill me if this makes it on the radio. Really? No, you shouldn't have said it then, you fucking titless junk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Who am I exactly. Sonny to? Boy's gonna know you suck cock for K Rock. What do you think of them apples? <laughs> Hi, I hope you enjoy Velvet Revolver, Sonny. I fucking drank a set of seeds for it. That's right. That's right. A set of seeds? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. You guys are nuts. <laughs> yeah. What, 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 what's your favorite radio show in all of New York City? 92.3 K-Rock. That, that's a, so that's that's a station, you, you stupid twat. That, oh, we're talking yeah. about a radio what show. What show? What show? The Opie and Anthony show. Oh. Uh, 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 all right, now fuck you. Saka, you suck. Fuck off. You fucking on. useless on, act, piece of Jeez, crap. Right. Why Tom, does everyone like them? Here's what uh, you win. Tom Petty's going to oh staple your pussy God. lips. <laughs> <laughs> all right, hey, uh, what's your name, Pat? Is that board over there? All right, listen, we're going to put you both on hold, and we're going to try to do something with you, all right? Just hold on. Uh, we'll be right back. Hold on the line. Uh, do not hang uh, up. We're going we're gonna to pick one to give the tickets to. Or we might uh, give them okay. uh, to both of you. Yeah, maybe we'll uh, okay. That's a good idea. All right, just put them on. What's your favorite station to suck cock to? Oh, God. That's where you have to say the uh, the call letters. All right, ready? We're rolling tape. Here we go. Rolling tape. <clears throat> What's your favorite station to suck cock to? K-Rock. <laughs> Still trying. Damn. All right, hold on the line. Hold on the line. There they go. All right. Oh, in the dot com. Oh, they're in commercials over there. <laughs> oh, God. All right, why don't we take a break? We'll do the line of the day next and get the fuck out of oh, here. Oh, my God. <sighs> it's Opie and Anthony. It's the Opie and Anthony Show. Opie and Anthony. I think we've done enough damage here today. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't even get to talk about Brittany being a lesbo. Is she a lesbo? No. She looked a puss. Yeah, there's going to be an article How do you think she out? got pregnant? In OK Magazine. Sure. Somebody fucking spilled a load into her by accident. <laughs> they walked by and tripped with a beaker of it. <laughs> <laughs> she kept this a beaker. At least 15 women in her life. Uh, porn stars coming uh, forward. Mm -hmm. Uh, she supposedly hit on uh, Jenna, Javis, uh, Jenna Jameson. So what? Also, uh, Tara Patrick has a story, too, supposedly. Oof. And anonymous former employee has sources. I wonder if Brittany yeah. broke broke wind in Tara's face, or Tara yeah. broke wind. In, that's my fantasy. Yeah. yeah. See, Brittany. <clears throat> I love that people are acting like that's ripping her down from some great, like she's the president. Yeah. She ate a pussy. Ooh. Oh, that whore ate a pussy. <laughs> I'll that's never weird. not buy her music again. <laughs> yeah, exactly. uh, no one's going to be buying anything she puts out. <clears throat> From this day forth, like like it cares, like it matters. Yeah. I mean, all right, let's do uh, line of the day. I agree. We used up all the energy in that the last ten minutes. I like so, this uh, seat, by the way. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Here's the first runner-up line of the day. I still have my wristbands from when my daughters were born, so I can go steal babies. Why not? <laughs> Fuck them and eat them. <laughs> Why didn't that win? This should be number one. 
But that just you happened, you lazy fox. <laughs> that's second part. Why, why does the line of the day oh. always happen in the last five Than. minutes of the show? What do you think? Than's fucking calling you stupid. No. No, it's a, great, it's a great line, but I'm very suspicious when the line of the day or runner-up line of the day comes from the last five minutes of the show. That's all. May I borrow this, Bob? Sorry. It's, it's actually more difficult to throw this together at the last minute. Ooh. Yeah. Mm. All right. Mm. So. Why? And who's going to argue with him? He can knock your teeth out with one spin uh, with his fucking cock. Kick. Mm. Fucking kung fu Leroy. His fucking long, smooth cock. And his doll eyes. With some, <clears throat> with some fucking bumps to the base. <laughs> <laughs> Here's another runner-up line of the day. Right. 63, and then all those zeros, and then it says in print, billion dollars. Back. So he wants that. But he wants it backed by gold and silver, delivered via UPS. What is he, a Bond villain? <laughs> yes. United this States Parcel Service, service oh, to the... Fuck, I stepped over it. It's a great line. <laughs> Damn it! Try harder. Note to self. Take away a star. It'd be funny if the next runner-up was what you just said. <laughs> <laughs> and I write it down. Listen better. <clears throat> See, I gotta do it. Listen better. All right, very good line from Anthony, who hopefully will be back tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure, yeah, she's taking his girl. She's okay. And then we got Washington uh, live show for Washington. Washington. Lots, of, lots of things going on for the the Washington. Oh yeah, let's say the XM. We're having the uh, car, car crash comedy. It's going to be played actually on Free FM, um, or whatever this, the, the the fucking terrestrial thing is down there. So come down mm -hmm. uh, for car crash comedy. You get to go up and do. Uh, uh, you have to email uh, our, our own gay Sam. It's Sam at foundrymusic dot com, but in the heading you have to write uh, "car crash comedy faggot," and uh, that's how he knows to take you seriously. Otherwise, he won't even read it. He won't yeah. even know what. Lo, he literally doesn't understand things it, that aren't addressed. It's a fact. great concept we did in Philly, man. Uh, these guys, they they. None of them have been on radio to begin with. Mm -hmm. They do it in front of like a, about 20 and listeners. And so they tell jokes? Or so the pressure's on. And then we sit there, and if we don't like a joke, we car crash them. They get three car crashes, and then they're out. Oh, that's pretty It's great. a great concept, And it's in man. front of the whole audience? The oh, audience. No, no, it was in front of like 25 people of, of, of listeners. The show. But they're going to get to... No, no, they, they're in there watching. It's like a room like this with people. In, they Just imagine yeah. this room with 25 people, yeah. and you're a guy that's never really done radio, but you think you're funny. You step mm -hmm. up to the mic and try to tell jokes as everyone's just staring at you. Three crashes. Try to last as long as That's you can. Great. It's either what two minutes or three crashes. Right. And the winner will get to go on uh, 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 the traveling virus show and perform in front of a bunch of people. So they're all comics, but they're new comics, they're young comics. So a guy That's will get to go up and perform in front of ten thousand people. And I got to call awesome. Kid Chris because the guy that won Car Crash Comedy in Philly wants out. I know. He doesn't want to do the show. He's scared. He's panicking. He's the kid. The kid. He's old. Guys, he's fifty six. He's he's up there, and but he's afraid to work for ten thousand people. Yeah, he's, but he's funny. He's funny. He's four foot eight. Yeah, about. He's wow. diminutive. He's what? Diminutive. He's like a little. He's like a he's little thing. thing. Little, little fella. He's a rapeable prejuria man. He's a wee fella. A wee fella. He's a wee one. Before we get to line of the day, uh, Robert, thank you for some great radio today. Oh, I thought so. <laughs> right. What, what the fuck? Was I don't know, dude. <laughs> was so I was weird. thinking about some other shit. <laughs> Were you? Dude, I was just thinking about something. No, else. you weren't sure if I was. Uh, serious or not, but you gave us great radio again today. Right. RobertKellyLive.com, whatever the fuck you're doing. <laughs> Yo, awesome. And for me, you can go to uh, my uh, page and yeah. Yeah. buy happy endings because I'm selling it if you want to. You sell it on your page? Still on the uh, bestseller list. All right. Thanks for my copy. It's time for your... Uh, you don't have a copy? No. Fuck you. It's time for your... Fuck you. It's time for your... Uh, it's time for your... Uh, line of the day. Yeah. Line of the day. I don't look at Tracy like that. We work together. It's a professional relationship, and I respect what well, she does. I want a program director. <laughs> Kennedy. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Louis C.K. Line of the day. And Louis has got a big tour he's doing. Uh, it's called Chewed Up. Chewed Up. Coming to Kansas City and Madison, Wisconsin, and all sorts of shit. All the hot spots. Oh, yes. Every shitbox city you live in, Louis will be I'll in. I'll be there. And please buy Shameless, my DVD on Amazon. Because Louis right. wants to do another fucking special, I'll so come out and watch him perform. Special. Come all watch right. it. Yeah. Drew Boogie's been just sitting yeah. there minding his own business. Drew, we're going to play your uh, You Need to Be Corrected thing. Uh, no, that could be like a real song. You know that. Yeah. And you did it with chemistry, right? Yes. No, I know it's a real song, but I mean something that you can maybe almost farm out to real radio stations, not this crap. Like stations that would play uh, music. Yeah. 
It's if, like they're, a, if they're into uh, playing all the references from this show, yes. I know, <laughs> but it, it goes past that. There's it's something about it. It's 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 cool. I've not had it. You haven't heard? We're going to end the show with it. Oops. What else you got going on, Drew? Uh, that's it. Uh, other than that, I'll be back with uh, some other remix. Here's uh, Drew Boogie. <laughs> See you tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>